two, one, two. That was four, I think. That's good enough. A one, two, three, four. Put it if it. Would you actually mind if I move that chair over? Because uh, I am far from centered. You are perfectly centered. Yeah, that's fine. Let's just move I'm usually... Scooch. Yeah, we're usually a little bit less uh, on equal here. Mm -hmm. um, but I <coughs> was playing things myself all day today, so... Equal in uh, proportions of uh, Pepsis that the two of us drink. Is that to say zero? I drink a lot of Pepsi. <laughs> okay, I don't drink any Pepsi. I don't like Pepsi. Pepsi is dope, man. Not sponsored by Pepsi. Hashtag could be sponsored by Pepsi. Hashtag Jacob can sponsor, be sponsored by Pepsi. I don't like Pepsi. I'll simp for... I mean, if the company Pepsi wants to sponsor me, I'll take some fucking Mountain Dew. That's all right. I would simp for Pepsi. Mountain Dew is the only drink that Pepsi does better than Coke. What's the equivalent, Sprite? Roughly. There really is none. The closest thing is Sprite, but then Pepsi has Sierra Mist. So. I mean, I guess. Not gonna lie, though. I got... I drank some, like, really ratchet Mountain Dew. Speaking of ratchet. Because... Here you go. <laughs> no, it's your turn, bitch. Is it? Yeah, you started. You did the space section before getting it. Oh, right. This is part of the same level. Yeah. To be fair, I also did the space section before getting to the level we started on last time. And then did that level anyway. I have no idea what we're doing here, my dude. Alright, I guess the volume doesn't um, need to be this low. I don't know either. There we go. So I guess the we're just going. I'd love to check, but I don't remember how to do that. I think they removed it for this game. Map. Okay, so we have a map. Yeah, there's no information. Just says, fuck it, just do it. Every, uh, every time we play this, I have to get used to the aim acceleration again, because I hate aim acceleration and never use it myself. <laughs> yeah, this looks relatively new. I don't think I've seen that guy before. Yeah, I'm, sh I'm pretty sure we're in new territory here. I think that guy is probably going to fuck me up if I don't kill him. Oops. Not if these guys fuck you up first. Nah. Your bomb glove is leveled up to masturbator arm. <laughs> it just shoots jizz at people. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Takes a long time to, to charge up, though. I mean, not if you level it up enough. <laughs> Wouldn't leveling it up make it take longer? No, leveling it up just makes it uh, more pleasurable, which reduces the charge up time. Ah, fair enough. What are you? Get out of here. Alright. Um. He's clearly just a miserable pile of secrets. What is a man? What is a lumbax? A miserable pile of secrets. That was not what I intended to do there, but you know what? It's fine. It worked. Mm -hmm. We're gonna pretend that's what I was doing. Die, Dr. Nefarious. You don't belong in this world. <laughs> Die, Doctor. Doctor. Please cease. Doc, die to. Did they really have to make these doors look like sphincters opening? <laughs> <laughs> Yay, I'm no longer the one who said the weirdest shit during this playthrough. <laughs> you freed me. Why, what was the uh, new running champion quote? 
What was so the fun. previous one? Yeah, what was the previous running quote? Uh, the previous weirdest thing I said was the fucking thing about, uh, Skid McMarks being a reference to fucking, uh, uh the slang term Skid Marks. Oh. <laughs> As opposed to Skid Marks, the literal thing on a road. Uh, you know what? I completely blocked that out of my mind <laughs> until you reminded me. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, I'm a professional internet idiot. It's my job to remind you that I'm an idiot. <laughs> We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. I caught that lack in and it decided to be like, it was like, oh shit, I'm supposed to... <laughs> well, fuck you too. <laughs> Just like coyote time, like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> the, the box is just sitting there reading a book. Oh fuck. Hang on. <laughs> uh, so last time I said that uh, the sequel was going to be uh, Ratchet and Clank versus the IRS. No, it's Ratchet and Clank versus the flu, which then. Well, that's what, that's what that one was. Yeah. So this is the sequel. So we need to talk about the IRS today. It's, it's a requirement. I mean, okay, but I think we're getting ahead of ourselves. We only get the flu after we beat these guys because they're canonically the, uh, the thing that everything in the galaxy is allergic to. Oops. I think I have gotten the flu now. All right. From falling in there. You have contracted the Gigarona. Oh, boy. Just what I wanted. It's like the normal Rona, but your skin turns purple. Even after you get over the flu. <laughs> that's it, though. You're perfectly yeah. healthy. Yeah, You're that's permanently purple. Yeah. If you manage to overcome the Gigarona, then you, you, your skin is just permanently purple. Nice. You it's a mark of pride at that point. Yeah. Studies show that about 10% of people who get it end up as a uh, contract deal for the Barney the Dinosaur uh, <laughs> live-action show. Nice. That's a large percent. Is this a really uncommon disease, or are there just a lot of live shows? No, it's a lot of live shows, but, like, they, they, they struggle to find a good actor for that. Ah. So they, like, change a lot, So Yeah, the, it, the turnover rate is pretty high. Mm. It's honestly not a very good job. It's a dangerous job. Well, yeah, the fucking children are gonna eat your ass. <laughs> Those children are, like, savage, but, man. For legal reasons, let's hope you don't have children eating your ass. They they metaphorically eat your ass. <laughs> All right, uh, time to go through the sphincter. Oh no no! <laughs> Isn't this where I came from? No, it's not. Cause here's a, a new skeleton pad. Don't get. Boing. I like how those things are there to eat your shit, but like yep. they don't actually like do it fast enough. Yeah, they, they they walk up, analyze you, and then decide to attack. They're like, hmm, do I really want to attack this guy? Nah. Actually, this guy owes me money. Yeah, he's gotta die. Bite. Zap. I see you. Zap. There we go. This level's actually okay. Yeah. I'm actually having uh, a pretty okay time. It looks fine enough. Yeah. It's simple. It's not requiring me to be too hyper. Mm -hmm. um, but it's got some nice little puzzle aspects. I'm fine with it. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure that the um, jail level was supposed to be a difficulty spike in the game's uh, design. Yeah. So now that the difficulty This thing does deal a lot of damage, though. Yeah, did it just do like 30 damage? You hit me twice. Okay. But still. It's still a lot. I mean, still, man. Yeah. Okay. I was wondering if that was ever gonna go. Yeah, I'm just like, uh, what's actually changing here as you're turning the screw? I knew it was the door because it zoomed in on the door, or at least turned the camera towards the door. Like, the focus was on the door. Yeah, that's what I meant. But, I didn't know, like, like is it gonna do it? <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty satisfying. Yeah, that was actually quite satisfying. 
I hate how imperfect these jumps are. Like, you slide down ever so slightly. Yeah, which just makes it way slower than I feel like it should be. Okay, what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but I felt like I was hitting my head on a, on a, a, a ceiling at the top for some reason. When you're trying to run away from the monster in your dreams. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> run! <laughs> I fucking hate that feeling, dude. <laughs> That's the worst. What is this? I don't know. Oh. Uh, same feeling as uh, when you are trying to run away from incoming waves on the beach. Fair enough. Yeah, because you're like slogging through the water. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm now permanently trapped in here. Cool. Due to this fucks eating the uh, jello. Mm -hmm. Goddamn jello eaters. Don't you know that thing's high in calories? You're gonna get obese. Why are. Why? Okay. I don't know why I had to push that so much for it to do that. Touch. Dude. <laughs> Dude. I'm waiting. <laughs> get on with it! <laughs> 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 uh, I like that. That's a good one. Uh, the last video broke records again. Oh boy, did we get seven views? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was a little more than that, and I don't remember the actual number. <laughs> Might have been like 15 or something. Oh, nice. Uh, was that it? Was that what I... I think... I don't think I got anything here. Why did I do that? Good question. Okay. Well, we're going this way. Alright, I know you got something at the very end that looked like a net. Oh, I got one of those hollow victims. Oh. Does that even do anything? I don't know. Uh, let's not right now. Let's work out on upgrading first. We don't want to use the tornado launcher because it has motion controls. I'm fine with the tornado launcher. Okay. Do we need them? But this is more important. Yeah. Antimatter transfluxer. Dynamically reconfigures the molecular structure of any target hit by the weapon, allowing the beam to pass directly through the target and hit additional foes. Okay. And I want this. Bolt. Might as well level up. Faster. Bada bing. Bada bing. Bada boo. A bada bing. Bada, bada boo. boo. Okay. Plasma stalkers. I thought I had more than that. What do we look like? A bunch of home homeless people? Yes. We're gonna go with that. that that's exactly what I was going to say. <laughs> I forgot that we're streaming. <laughs> <laughs> Careful. <laughs> what do we look like? A bunch of homes? <laughs> <laughs> they magically transform into fucking houses. I'm just imagining a really dope YouTube poop right now, with things taken out of context from our streams. It could be pretty good. Um, it's a it's a real shame that the uh, that sort of video style has uh, gone out of favor. Yeah. As of late, but it's still pretty good. I mean, it it doesn't help with that the copyright complaints exist. That's true. Can you that probably did. Mm -hmm. That probably was one of the main factors that killed it. And, of course, an evolving sense of humor. I guess, but I still like it. I think me and Nathan are the only people that still swear by YouTube groups. And you, I, I think some of them are funny. I just think that there's a, there's a, a massive number of them that are not. Uh, like, they're easy to make, so as a result, like, a lot of people made them. And most uh, of them aren't funny. That's true. You gotta, you gotta like pick somebody that you know. Yeah, I really like the one um, that's made entirely from clips of Wicker Man. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it's called, and I'm sure there's like 20 that are made entirely from Wicker Man. If you think it's only 20, then you're wrong. Valid point. There's probably like hundreds, yeah. if not thousands. But point being. Mm -hmm. There was one specific one I found of Wicker Man that I found really, really funny. <laughs> it 
it was called like Nick Cage is something something. Mm -hmm. Quote unquote. It's exactly what it is. Yeah, exactly. That was the title. Also, that box really didn't know if it wanted to blow up or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really though. Okay, you weren't there before. Why is everything on this side of the map flashing all of a sudden? Those enemies were doing it too. Hmm. Guess they're just having a disco right now. Oh, you say disco, you say. I mean, we can certainly add to the fun. Also, do we know what we're actually witnessing right here? Is there um, like a civil war on this planet? These dudes, who I think are... Oh, those are the space pirates. The space pirates are like fighting the... Natives. Like the defense... Well, I don't think they're natives. It's like the defense system... I mean, unless... Of whatever company is set up here. Okay. I mean, unless the uh, natives on this planet are just all robots, which could, it, which could be, but... Yeah, who fucking knows with this game? I mean, they seem to treat, like, robots... Uh, like, as equally valid, you know, members of society as yeah, that's true. organic folks. Unlike something like, uh, Star Wars, where they largely mistreat the robots. Mm hmm. So, are we gonna Do move you think on? these guys are ever gonna kill him? They're, it's like, it shows like it's dealing damage. Yeah, we're like seeing tick marks on both the space pirates and these guys. And that's what I want to know, is if they'll ever... Well, that guy's okay, dead. Okay, well, that's that's something. Yeah, development. Maybe this guy will die too? Whoa, what's he doing? He's just getting bombarded. I'm slowly losing my patience. <laughs> what? What? He's fucking respawned. No, he just has, I guess, more health. Damn. Okay. I hit him with three of those. I thought he was close to dead. Oh, and that guy just randomly blew up? I wanted him to die. That's why I was waiting. I didn't want to fight that thing. It was far away and dealt lots of damage. Ah, uh, yes. Kill him with the gelinator. <laughs> hmm. Oh, I can't. That, that's the joke. Well, I mean... I... It, it probably wouldn't deal damage. But I don't know that for a fact. It would probably make them feel really creeped up. Unfortunately, I cannot test it because I physically can't bring out the gelinator unless it's in an area they want me to. Mm -hmm. Which is a shame, because I would have liked to try it. Uh -huh. Also, it took you, like, walking back that entire screen in order to kill the creep. Yeah, those guys suck, like, seriously. Yeah. I sure hope we're not getting to that part of the game where everything starts having inflated health and damage. It seems like it's mostly just those guys right now. Mm-hmm. Um, because they're like melee enemies. Yeah, that's true. But still, at the end of the game, it, like it started out with them being one-off enemies. And then yeah, they no, became, I hate those guys. And then those dudes became enemies in every single room in the final level. Yeah. So I sure hope this ain't the trend. The trend. The trish. <laughs> Fair. Let's catch him off guard so he doesn't fucking obliterate me with that turret. Or he'll just fucking survive two explosives to the face. Okay. I hate those guys. Yeah, those things are actually doing 15 damage a hit. Yeah. We really need and to find... And they have shields, so I can't just shoot them. Yeah, we really need to find somewhere to work out so that we can get more health. <laughs> like, where's the intergalactic gym so that we can just uh, pump some iron? This feels special. Like, this would probably be a lot more di manageable if we had, like, 100 health right now. We need to go to the space gym to pump some space iron. Mm-hmm. In order to get um, space, space muscles. muscles. <laughs> yeah. You know, scientifically speaking, space muscles would be different because um, when you're in space, uh, there's no gravity. Yes. So, like, muscles do actually develop differently. Well, not only differently, they kind of develop... Oh, shit. I think that barge is a checkpoint. Yeah. Yeah, Good. that's what I thought. 
Also, those boxes did not spawn properly. <laughs> also, I could have just gone here and I would have gotten full health. Yeah. Which weapon do oh well. You oh. What about the boxes spawning properly? I didn't see it. Yeah, if you... It's 20 minutes in. But if you care, you can reverse the stream to see that when you respawn, the boxes appeared and then just, like, collapsed all over the place in a fucking heap. Hey, bada bing, bada, bada boom. boom. So not allow yeah. the plasma beast to detect and attack enemies' targets from farther away. That's fucking lame. Whatever, we got it. Yeah, whatever. Now I guess we can update, upgrade the tornado on here. Alright, so if we're ever in a pinch during the final boss fight... We can use the tornado launcher. We have enough for the negotiator, but it's most of our money. Yeah, I don't know. It could be useful. The nano swarmers are cool too, and they're pretty cheap. Razor claws. So we get to do our best um, plasma sword from Halo, Halo 2 yeah. impersonation. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. I'm surprised you thought that as well. Uh, I don't know if that's that's probably not worth it. This, I'm guessing, might be. It's pretty cheap. In the so grand I scheme of things. Dozens of nanosecs that attack your mm -hmm. enemies with pyro pyro That said, I am intrigued by the negotiator. Yeah, but it's really expensive. <laughs> That's true, but it's probably really fucking good. Too. All right, you're right. Let's not get anything yet. Um, when it either becomes an issue or after our next armor upgrade. All right. We can, uh, because we always yeah. need to try to get the armor upgrades as soon as we can get them. So that does unfortunately exactly. mean we're going to have a lot more deaths than we, you know, might otherwise have. Yeah. So after the next armor upgrade, or when we need an, or when we actually need an extra weapon, yeah, we'll get that. Just like hello, boys. Go, my minions. Do everything for me. <laughs> uh. Alright, fuck that. Whoa, whoa, okay. Oh, Not cool. Did they just hit you while you were down? Yeah. What a they bunch did. of death swords. Come on. That's not okay. You don't hit a man while he's down. Yeah. For that, you get bombs. And nothing else. Oh shit, because it's level 5, it did something. See? It ah, they bounce around now. Nice. That's cool. It looks like you get uh, some free benefit whenever you level something up to level 5. Although it doesn't tell you anymore what that benefit is. Yeah, that's true. Also, it might have changed its name. Fusion Bomb. Is that what it was before? I don't know. It was something similar to that, but I think that is enough. Maybe it was fusion grenade. Maybe. I, don't, I know it didn't change much, but I think it did change. Yeah. Just like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Jesus. Oh, shit. The two sides are ganging up to take on their common foe. <laughs> Maybe I should have just stayed out of it. I'm gonna get. I'm just gonna buy ammo after I do this. Yeah. I hit this fucker, guys. He actually does suck up quite a bit of damage. That's true. Okay, that was a decent amount of ammo I just picked up. Now let's purchase the rest. Wonderful. Good. Let's start with the. Plasma stalker. Actually, let's start with this. Haha, uh -huh, you out. Come down here. Ah, uh, yes. Kaiden. Ever going. Dude, these guys do have a lot of health. You really jinxed us when you said that. I wasn't jinxing it, I was predicting it. 
<laughs> there's a there's a difference. You said that and then immediately it happened. That feels more like a change. No, it was more like, oh man, like a jinx would be phrased differently. Like, a jinx would be like, wow, this, uh, I sure hope the rest of the enemies don't have this much health. And I would... Was, That's basically what you said, though. No, I was more I was saying, oh, I sure hope this uh, doesn't become a trend. That's like the same thing, though. No, it's not. Pretty close. Like, jinxing is more along the lines of, like, oh, you, like, you're, uh, pointing out your good fortune, and then your fortune turns on you. Um, prophetic prediction is more like, oh, I see w how the winds are blowing, and I'm going to call it out. Also. This isn't 2020 in a nutshell. <laughs> like a tornado's going on as he's just fucking dancing. This is a good strategy, I think. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that this man has survived three tornadoes is a problem. Yes. Like, I know the tornado's not that good, but it should be. Should be better. Like, if it forces you to use the motion controls, it better be more powerful than that other one. Well. Oh. Oh. Well. Oh! What the fuck? <laughs> I like that. That's good. That was worth it, if nothing else. That man certainly ain't in Kansas anymore. Alright, I'm trying a new strategy here called not being fucking involved. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't notice there were enemies from both sides in this conflict. I'm going to literally let them fight each other. Never mind, they're all coming for me. Well, at least I can funnel them onto this uh, bridge and then just shotgun them to death. Yeah. That also works, I guess. I guess. Unintended success. Yeah, basically. Alright. Plus, those were the dudes who were dealing me like a billion damage. Mm hmm. Fuck these guys, too, though. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. The fucking centipede damage spongers. Centipede demon, I thought you were gonna say. They don't go off screen while trying to <laughs> eat you. Are you sure? They, they went off screen, but they weren't trying to <laughs> eat you. They were trying to eat my ass. <laughs> Maybe Wombax's ass is just a delicacy on this planet. Pretty sure a Wombax's ass is del delicacy wherever you go. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're in danger. <laughs> Everyone wants to eat Ratchet's ass in one form or another. Mm -hmm. Whether it's literal or figurative. Um, I guess Angela was the only one that succeeded. Did she? I mean, it probably happened off screen. Maybe. We're not sure. Unconfirmed. But certainly a possibility. Hmm. Oh boy, double bullets. I'm sure someone on the internet has uh, some evidence. Double oh, I didn't even realize the double bolts. Yeah. I was too busy thinking of a joke about fucking oh. corn. Come on, <laughs> rule 34. Of course it's out there. Well, yeah, but yeah. Also, that was my joke. Just I was trying to phrase it in a more clever way. Uh, oops, that's a corner. Run. <laughs> Help me, please. <laughs> Start running. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. These guys, I'm full off, I guess. Yeah. I love how somehow I always seem to find health crates when I'm full health. Yeah. But never when I actually need it. It's like, oh boy, I'm at like five health. Can you give me any health crates? No, how about some bolts, man? Lol. Well, I made through that section perfectly. What's this? Oh, health crates. Fuck. Nope. Nope. I saw that coming. I ain't having none of that. Mm -hmm. I'm glad yeah. we're in the future trilogy. <laughs> I'm not sure how much more of that original trilogy I could take. 
I mean, three was doing all right until the very end when it fucking dropped the ball like it was hot. Yeah, <laughs> and I feel like uh, these games might do that as well. Might just become really difficult near the end. Uh, they might. We're getting there. Shit. What can we do you for? Right, I'm gonna wait before I do anything over there. Uh, oh I might as well boy, buy that though. Thing. What's this? Transmorpher. Transform your enemies into lovable penguins. Oh, they're grenades now. That's actually a lot more useful. In my opinion. What were they before? It was a gun, remember? But you had to shoot them for like two hours. Oh, the fucking sheepinator? Yeah. Well, that's good. Keep your eyes peeled, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be here soon. <laughs> I forgot about that! Remember, it's not uh, Ratchet, it's Mustachio Furioso. <laughs> of course. How could I have forgotten? Game over. <laughs> Ratchet is dead. Do 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 do. <laughs> what would you do if one of these games canonically killed Ratchet? Um, stop playing because then the tr the game would end. <laughs> Unless... No, the rest of the game you have to play is playing. Oh yeah, no, that ain't happening. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop! Oh, uh, jumping. Uh. He be jumping. Yeah, they made a spin-off game with just Clank, and I'm pretty sure they ain't gonna do that again. No. I jumped way too late, because I didn't see how fucking fast I was gonna go around that corner. You know, because you're a video game character, you jump and stay airborne for a long time. Mm -hmm. But as you jump, you're turning Still a corner, running. and yeah. you're, like, cornering as you're jumping. That's a good point. So you have, like, centripetal force on your jump somehow. <laughs> Yeah, I hadn't considered that actually. It's it's not like a fault against the game, it's just funny. Yeah. It's just video game logic. Mm -hmm. Oh fuck. Somehow I lost track of which one I was and I was looking at rockets. Yeah, well I mean there's like tons of shit on screen, so it's really not your fault. <laughs> uh the um <laughs> <laughs> What do I do here? Oh. Okay. Be a lot. Are you even doing this? Oh no, you're you're taking off magic pixel by magic pixel. Yeah, he's gonna kill me. Well, you only need like one more hit. Speaking of which. I'm like, you only need one more hit. I wasn't <laughs> fucking prepared for that at all. Yeah, because we didn't know his moves. Yeah. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? It auto switches. Oh it does. Yeah. I don't know why I fucking switched it. I'm so used to doing that because of the because of previous, the previous games. games all made you do. It. Yeah. I oh I have to use a fucking disco ball on this guy later. Oh yeah, you gotta use the disco balls on all the dudes. Yeah. All, all the mini bosses. At least and the bosses. bosses. Yeah, at least the bosses. Mini bosses prefer. Okay, let's let's get a better start out here and not get obliterated instantly mm -hmm. when I get to the boss. I mean these guys. I mean, he does deal like 25 damage a hit, so I don't know what we're not doing because our health definitely isn't keeping up. Yeah, but we're at like uh, max armor upgrades. Mm hmm. So it could just be because we're not like grinding at all. Yeah, but what's there to grind for? Like Leviathan Souls? Leviathan Souls, Bolts, um, and Health. But Health just. You it comes automatically when you fight things. Yeah, it comes so automatically as you fight. Yeah, so you can grind for it. Like, you can grind for it, but there's nothing incentivizing it until you get to, like, huge walls in the story. Yeah. Just like, nope, you didn't play the game for long enough, now you're gonna suffer. That angle change really throws me off. Hmm. Because Ratchet, like, isn't the focus for a second. Yeah. That's why, like, what the, uh, as they call the four corners of this, uh, theory. I am not familiar. Of, like, where the game, where a picture wants to draw your attention to. I am not familiar. Okay, so that shockwave thing is what's killing me. So that dealt 20 damage. Good to know. I guess gotta, I just gotta be more careful with the shockwaves as well. Yeah. It 
it's time to party. Or not, I guess. I guess we'll go fuck ourselves. He's dancing. Oh, I see well. it. Yeah, it's just a really shitty dance. Also, my aim does not go up. I don't control the vertical. Hmm. Alright, I guess it was a dance. It technically was a dance. Yeah, I was really curious because this seems like a big-ass robot boss. I wasn't sure. I was like, how is this thing gonna dance? Which is part of the reason I wanted to do it, yeah. actually. I wanted to know how the fuck it was gonna mm. dance. Uh, not well is the answer. Yeah, I should use another one. Can I hit it with this? Is it doing it to me? I'm not I seeing any pixels go down. It's hard to tell anyway, but it's not. I don't think it is. Jesus Christ. This thing takes so much fucking hits. Yeah, it really does. It should be like half dead by now, honestly. Yeah, seriously. For how much we've unloaded into it? Yeah, I've unloaded the ammo of like four of my guns. I need to, I might as well just uh, do this again. You should probably use the BFG at this point. Oh, I'm gonna get to that. It killed me though, even though there was a fucking dance thing out. Which is bullshit, mind you. I had enough of that. Don't care, just want the ammo. Oh, it looks like it refunds your ammo if you die. Oh, I guess it does. Which is nice, I guess. We don't have to run into <laughs> that uh, situation where you get bricked by the final boss in that table. Um, I think I broke the camera. Oh. How'd you do that, man? I got onto the rail before the cutscene started, and it broke the camera. <laughs> okay, camera's fixed. Alright, snap that. To reality. Oh, there goes gravity. We'll get to that in a second. Yeah. We'll get to that in two or three games. There is some gravity shit there. Okay, but I was talking about the gravity boots. Yeah, but there's some actual gravity shit. That's like magnet boots, I guess. Okay. It's poorly explained canonically because, like, it's it's magnet boots. It's always has been magnet boots since the first game. Mm -hmm. But they let you jump now. Yeah. Because I'm... they realize the game sucked when you can't jump. Yeah. Because, <laughs> like, there really isn't any gameplay yeah. when you're using the magnet boots. It's just mm -hmm. the gameplay is walking forward. Yeah, and occasionally shooting and hoping you don't get blown up in the process. Mm hmm Because you can't fucking dodge. <laughs> yep. Um, I know those things behind me can't hit me, but it's not stopping me from getting paranoid about it. Yeah. Alright, you know what? We're going straight for the BFG this time. Yep. I think we found the weapon that can hit the blocks. Oh fuck, he destroyed part of the ground. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna put a uh, Zircon out. Oh! Uh. <laughs> we'll be right back. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And I'm also gonna put a Disco Ball out, and then I'm going to... Ah, uh, Shard Reaver. You know... No, actually, we use the Buzz Saws. Yeah, I agree. Those saws are better. Because those seem to actually deal good in boss builder. I also don't want to be on this side where that thing is busted. I want to be able to jump back and forth. I'm then going to be an asshole. <laughs> That's what they're in the game for, so. Yeah. When I was, uh, the when I played of, this... The point of the devices is to use them when you're fighting tough enemies. Yeah. Um, when I played this as a kid, I never used the devices, so it's kind of funny now that I'm very heavily reliant on them. Yeah. I don't know how the hell I did this as a kid. Oh! Ugh. Okay, this is better actually. This is fine. This is preferable. Wait, maybe this isn't preferable. So, it's like you thought it's fucking rolly bitches everywhere now. Mm. Uh, do I have one more? No, I do not. I do have Confuzzler Gas though. I don't know what that does, but it might help. 
worth trying anyway. Ow. I think I might not be supposed to be down here. Well, I mean, it's throwing enemies. So clearly it was intended for it to be possible. Yeah, but when he did that slam attack, it looked like he slammed the ceiling, but the uh, wave appeared down here and nearly killed me. Huh. Well, I mean, yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck. This is actually hard. Yeah, I can tell. Okay, it definitely we, does refill. We better make sure it doesn't uh, use up the devices. It didn't last time. Because I used, like, almost all of the... Uh, mm. The globe things, and it still... Well, they were still there when I okay. started. That's good. Yeah, so, I don't have to worry about that. Mm -hmm. And also, we still don't know why we're here, because we uh, <laughs> took a week break. Yeah. As always. Uh, yeah, I remember them mentioning the things we were allergic to. But, but that was mostly, like, lore. Yeah, what was the actual reason we were we here? We don't remember. To kill this thing, I guess. Sure. And get whatever results from this. Mm -hmm. Whatever the fuck that is. The result is that we get to progress the game. Yeah, fair enough. I hate jumping uphill like that. Yeah, that's just... I don't feel as powerful. Yeah. I don't feel like I can, can safely do that. Your jump gets, like, nerfed. Alright, this time I'm trying something new. Alright, that's bullshit. <laughs> this is what I'm trying. You tried to fucking climb the enemy. No, I'm just trying to fucking immediately go to the ground so I don't have to deal with any of the other bullshit. Nope, nope. Let's throw one of these out. Yeah, we should save the BFG until he's got like uh, two thirds of his health. Because uh, we can like mow through the rest. Plus, if I'm on the ground, it spawns a lot. It seems to spawn a lot more mobs. Mm -hmm. But they can be distracted by the, the dancing. Anyway. Yeah, and they don't have the best movement speed. Most of them, anyway. Do we still not know what the Confuzzler gas does? No. Based on the name, I would assume it confuses them, but that doesn't seem to be doing anything. Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, that's like a, like a mace thing that shoots out. Hmm. That's interesting. <laughs> Alright, we're not doing this. This is bad. Yeah. No. This is a terrible idea. Also, this thing's fucking useless. Hello. Welcome to more useless items. Mm. That seems to be doing something. Yes, we are dealing damage. It just feels like we're trying to slay a dragon with a rolled up newspaper. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. But we are making progress. True. Also, True. we could probably end this with the BFG. Probably. Well, I'm make Shark Reaper just to be safe. Yeah. Shark Reaper does decent. I'd say more than decent. I'd say it's actually pretty darn good. We have any more gas things we can use or something? Leech bombs. Sure, why not? Mr. Zircons. Let's throw one out. Now we can definitely go into the BFG. Yeah. I'll break it out as soon as I'm out of these because I only have a few of them left. In anymore. fact, I bet we'll have a BFG ammo to spare. If we do it right. Oh, 
Ah, uh, I was wrong. Magic <laughs> pixel. Yeah. That did work though. Yeah. That was a tough one. I mean, it wasn't that tough. It just forced me to actually use all my resources, yeah. which I usually don't have to. Yeah, usually it's only the final bosses that do that shit. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Oh, that's the helmet that. We that's have why we're here. To get the fucking helmet. What a fucking reason to have forgotten. Oh yeah. This is the MacGuffin of the game. <laughs> they were hiding the game's fucking MacGuffin. Yeah. Incredible. I think they followed us. Oh goddamn it! I guess we're not that close to the end of the game because now there's some more bullshit. Contrived plot reasons to continue the plot. Here's the controller, by the way. I'm pretty sure it's you. All right. Why don't you try and take it, Grog Breath? You wouldn't begrudge an old pirate. If by some chance there's another boss fight and you want to give it back to me, you may. <laughs> but also, if you want to hold on to it, I won't complain. Try to follow us, and I'll get ye bow to stern. Robot. Yeah, what is the logic of that? <laughs> like, do they get fat by, like, <coughs> uh, accumulating too much fuel? Or are they just built fat? <laughs> Good question. Is it a defect or an intended design? Mm -hmm. Alright. We're, we're done with this place. Yeah. Welcome to the Krusty Krab. <laughs> Welcome to the Grump. <laughs> like the hatch opens and just kicks him off. <laughs> <laughs> Go flying into the into the trees. And that's how we caught the flu. Common space practice I just have the passive version ever star in order to block my Polaris combo. Wow, that sounds like These guys kind of an overreaction to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you oh. like reading the lore now, huh? Well, yeah, there's nothing else getting me invested in the game. <laughs> well, there's lore and then there's story. Slag's Fleet. I'm surprised I didn't have to do a space section then. Me too, actually. It really sounded from the description like you were going to. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, fine. Yeah, we just did one, so it makes sense that they're yeah. not one. Ratchet, the situation is getting dire. I am sending a transmission to Krog's comm unit requesting assistance. Fine, but I'm not waiting around. We need to get that Dimensionator before Slag can cause any more trouble. Yeah, and the Dimensionator is the thing that allows us to destroy the Kragmites once and for all, right? It's the thing that allowed them to destroy the Kragmites already. Oh, that was a waste. All but one of them. The one that took over the galaxy. Mm-hmm. And then that Kragmite used the same thing to release them, uh, I guess? Either, I know, I think he just genocided them. Yeah, he used it against them. Oh no, no, you, you, you genocided them in general. Mm hmm. Because the Dimensionator only, like, traps them in pocket dimensions. And we don't, uh. He, he definitely would have used it if he had it by now. Yeah. Because he didn't have it. Yeah, he just got it. And then we stole it from him. Yeah. And then these guys stole it from us. And yeah. now we're going to go steal it back. Mm hmm. Would you? Please do. <laughs> Yeah, these dudes actually have a lot of health. You know why? Because this is like one of the last levels. I think it's this and maybe one more. Mm -hmm. Or it might just be this. I don't actually know. Yeah. We're pretty close to the end. I think. I mean, the MacGuffin is in play now, so yeah. the only thing that we can do now is fight like, over fight it. Over it. Yeah. yeah. And that can only go on for so long. Mm-hmm. 
before it gets also, fucking bo- old. Pirates of the Caribbean shit. Discount Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> you know that's what they're doing. Yeah, I mean, clearly. <laughs> Everything that involves pirates after that has to be Pirates of the Caribbean. Because it was the only fucking good pirate thing ever, pretty much. <laughs> you know, the animated Sinbad movie was really good. I have not seen that. Really? It's actually good. I'd recommend it. Okay. It's a DreamWorks movie, so it's understandably... Hit or miss. Yeah. DreamWorks is very hit or miss with their products. Yeah, but I think it was a hit. Okay. It's really it's really beautifully animated, and its story is actually mm-hmm. very good. Yeah. Let me break this now. And honestly, that's all that matters to me. Mm-hmm. Good story, oh, good characters, good animation. Alright, I'm going to turn it up a little bit. Yeah, because we just straight up can't hear what these guys are saying. Yeah. We can kind of hear what Clank was saying if we're completely silent, but mm-hmm. these guys, not at all. I doubt that was anything important anyway, but it'd still be nice to hear. Come on. Let me pick the buzzword. <laughs> Also, oh, apparently we need to dodge these guys somehow. Yeah, this is tough. I need to look stuff. I'm not playing, so I wouldn't know. Oh, I fought a couple of these guys earlier. Yeah. They are annoying, especially in confined places like this. Like, I straight up can't avoid them because they shoot in too many. And they come from behind me. I don't know, you keep putting yourself against the wall a lot, which is generally a bad idea. Although the things coming from behind you are bullshit. Yeah. That is definitely bullshit. Oh no, I think there's another big clank section here. Uh, huh. I remember it very well. Only a pirate can pass through these doors, lad. Be gone. I'm pretty sure big clank is in this section. Yeah. The triangle is to activate talk and to switch weapons. Yeah. Well, you can't transform right in front of him. <laughs> God damn. Even though you just did. Only a yeah. true pirate may oh no, I've never done the fucking jigs. You just press the direction they say. Alright. Oh, and if they say shake your booty, you just switch the left stick with left and right. Okay. Like, rapidly. That's really it. Fine. You can also see the animations of the guys in the back starting before they say it. I can't fucking hear them. It's just shitty DDR. Uh, you're so fucking dead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they only ever call it the Plasma Beast. Yeah, it's only the plasma piece. <laughs> it's like clearly they intended to use the to do more, but they never did. They just didn't. I'm surprised that didn't outright kill you right there. Alright. I need to figure out how to fucking That fucking fireball went right through your head. Yeah, it really did. <laughs> Is this doing damage? No. Yeah, it's just very slowly because it has to get him on the rebound. Mm-hmm. There you go. Yeah. At least it did something. Those assholes suck. Yeah. But at you least should at least be able to destroy the turrets with enough damage. But what if there's a turret section? There, I don't think there is in this one. There hasn't been yet, has there? No. We're almost at the end, and we've seen tons of those turrets. I feel like if there was a required turret section, we would have seen it by now. Mm-hmm. Then again... <laughs> yeah. Just watch it be a turret section right now. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm pretty sure it's just a fucking it's just a fucking clank section. Cause I remember being really mad <laughs> at this level. Uh, yeah, this is the next best gun that we've got, and I'm dead. <laughs> oh, time to do that all again. Ratchet walks into a war zone, gets shot in the chest, and dies. Yep. I mean, that's pretty much all of this game. Yeah. Except usually it takes more than one shot. (laughs) 
wonder if there's an armor thing on this level. Because it feels like we there's definitely more armor. Yeah. But then there's and it doesn't feel like there's that much left of the game. Yeah, more than just like two armors, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the power armor shows up in every game, so I, I think there's definitely just one more. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. I didn't get it in most games. Right. But. Well, we got it in two, and I don't think that technically was in three. Maybe you're right. Maybe it wasn't in three. Or unless, unless it was, but it didn't cover the face. If it isn't, they should definitely bring it back. Yeah. Because that shit was cool as hell. Oh, they're not gonna make me refight the mini boss? Okay. Thanks, I guess. Oof. From 83 down to 61. Oh, well, you did markedly better this time. Yeah, because I didn't have to fight the mini boss. That's true. Hadn't considered that. What happened to the dudes you could squat? Um, I guess we're just not fighting any Kragmites. I missed that. You know, how did- Tachyon's forces were awesome. Yeah, how did Tachyon repopulate his entire species with just himself? Do they like- They're- they're not his species. Oh, okay. Those are just like fishies. Oh, those- Tachyon doesn't look anything like them. Oh, the I guess, um, the- Kragmites are just, or no? The his minions are just fucking fish. Yeah, I guess. Like, genetically engineered to be sold. Yeah, yeah, I guess the fish are just the uh, enemy race of this game. This place definitely looks familiar, and it also looks very final bossy. This room right here. Hey guys, how's it going? Oh shit! <laughs> this isn't the bathroom. <laughs> This definitely looks like a boss arena to me. Yeah. Uh. Ha. That's because it is a boss arena! That was some horror movie shit right there. Ha. Oh, that's cool. His armor's coming off. If he starts discoing, I hope he falls into a lot. No. I definitely used it on this guy before. He's funny, but he's not gonna fall. <laughs> I, I, it was worth the effort. I wanted to see if it would happen. Yeah, wouldn't it be hilarious if these games like did something like that? Yeah. Where certain items could just be used to just insta kill people if you, if they logically made sense. Yeah, like in, in context. Yeah. Like Goblin Slayer logic. Goblin Slayer is just D and D if it was but uh, DM'd by a really permissive DM. Hmm. That's kind of true. I'd love to see a game where the premise is like, everything is way, way too powerful for you, but you're given all these crazy tools with which you can do some stupid shit. Yeah, so like, the, <laughs> the, the intent is for you to sort of like, bend the rules. Yeah, the intent is for you to tease every boss. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, you mean that's not Dark Souls? <laughs> Some of the bosses are definitely cheesable. Uh, Taurus Demon. Well, they're cheesable, but they're probably not intended to be. Yeah, exactly. Alright. I'm not saying I, they are. I'm just saying that there's a good portion of them are cheesable. The Taurus Demon is cheesable. Nice. Capper Demon is not, unfortunately. Uh, the Centipede Demon is. Centipede? Is that what it's called? Yeah, but Centipede Demon is not that hard if you have a shield. Uh, I had a lot of trouble with it. I beat him legit, but I did have a lot of trouble. Um, what other cheesable bosses are in DS1? I think that's really it. Uh, Gwyn, if you know how to parry, you can kill him. In I don't think I'd seconds. call that cheese, though. I mean, maybe okay. a little bit. But the thing is, clearly they, they had to flag him like, this guy can be parried. Yeah. So clearly they intended that to be a thing. It just feels like cheese. If, That's fair. If you try to do it the right way and then Slayers learn to parry. Uh, what the fuck, moonwalking? <laughs> the disco balls aren't out yet. Uh, he can't be hit by that, and also, he's dead. 
I was gonna say he can't be hit by that, and also that's the guy that insta kills you if he gets near you. Speaking of cheese. Yeah, that was funny. Uh, okay, DS2. The, uh, knight on that one platform. I'm, I don't know the game very well. Yeah. The one that you can trick into lunging off the cliff. I haven't played DS2. Mm, I've played a good portion of DS2, but not all of it. Uh, the final boss is pretty cheesable, as I, I never got there. I never got to the final boss, but I've heard the final boss is cheesable. Okay. Because if you just walk in a circle around her, it, her AI just fucking dies and doesn't do shit. <laughs> okay, how do I do this? I think I have to disable their shields first. And these guys sort of wall off the turret. <laughs> yeah. DS2 has by far the most bosses, so I'm sure there's a lot of cheesable ones. Yeah. Just by nature of, well, I guess there's a lot of bosses. So. Yeah. There's also, more chances to cheat. That and also DS2 is not built that well anyway. <laughs> so I wouldn't be surprised if there was a lot of cheese. Yeah. Uh, cough, cough, uh, Iron Peak being at the um, top end of an elevator, despite you coming up onto, like, solid ground. I Unfortunately, I don't know that. Okay, so the thing about Earthen Peak is that um, the previous level has you going up a tower. Mm hmm and then you're beating a boss, and then there's an elevator that goes up from on the top of the tower. And after you get to the top of this elevator, you get to Earth and Peak, which is just some fucking hellscape. So it's, you're just saying it just doesn't make logical sense. Yeah, it, the, the levels don't connect in logical sense. Huh. That's odd. It's just one thing that really irked me about that. Like, They're probably trying to make some point about the distortion of space-time in the, in the Dark Souls universe. Because the Dark Souls universe is fucked up, in terms of like space and time. Well, not necessarily about space. Time, definitely. Also, am I doing this wrong? Well, yeah, time and spaces rearrange themselves between games. But that's because time is passing. No, but, like, an entire fucking, like, continent replaces part of fucking Lordran in the third game. In the third game, fucking Karthus is randomly buried below the swamps. Even though Karthus is supposed to be, like, a desert. Oh, yeah, because in the third game, the lore is all about, like, all of the... Prominent locations of the area are slowly collapsing, drift, each other. collapsing into each other. Yeah, but that, but that wasn't like a piece of lore until the third game. It because, wasn't. Yeah, because I thought it started in two. Because time was literally, like, the entirety of the universe was ending in three. But in two was just another. Comment. But in one and two, it feels like it, the whole. In one, at least, the whole premise is that, you know, the fire's gone out. Alright, I'm, sure I'm fairly sure you're not supposed to be here. Yeah, I... But the thing is, if it's not there, where am I supposed to Well, go, go back across the bridge. The process of elimination, that one's out. Okay. I know you looked left, but look over there just for my sake. Uh... Nope, that's somewhere you come back across as Clank. Yeah. Remember, I said there's Clank. Mm-hmm. Uh, left side over here is where you came from, of course. Yeah. But, there's nothing over here? Looks like you can get onto that platform. I, I can, but nothing happens. Do I need, like, a certain gadget to... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the thing I said is useless. Second page, top. The helipods? Yeah, that's what this is for. Oh. All right. <laughs> they fixed the problem with the with the multi shot, but they've created a new problem by adding this stupid piece of shit. <laughs> sure. Luckily, it's not as much of a problem due to the fact that we have three weapon wheels now. <laughs> like you don't have to put anything on the quick set. Yeah. It's all the weapon. Wheel. Yeah, it's just there. This is not a good time for it, but at some point I would like to see the penguin thing. <laughs> right. Also, apparently, um, it's not letting me use the normal controls because it's a fixed camera. Angle. What the hell? Yeah, it's fixed camera, angle, so I can't like 
shoot and run. Yeah, no, I see that. And it's really fucking me up right now. Yeah, it's almost like the mode we set it on is the correct way to play the fucking game. And it always should have been that way. And they just disabled it randomly right here. Yeah, that sucks. That's Why would they do that? Yeah, I'm just getting... They're just getting free hits on me as I'm trying to run away. I don't know how I'm going to avoid them getting free hits on me. You do have a lot of time with the rocket things. I wouldn't push it, but it's worth noting that they... It is a while before they get there. Yeah. Okay. Right. Now, you gotta take out those... Uh, because the whatever. the pirates are just gonna keep coming. Yeah. So focus the... the. You know what? Use the buzz blades, because you really don't have to aim with those. Because it hits everything. Yeah. There you go. That's how you do it. That's one down. That's two down. And it wasn't even the one you were aiming at. <laughs> Buzz blade moment. <laughs> Buzz blades be like. Okay, now the controls are back. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to repeat this because I lost too much health. Yeah. But now we know how to deal with it. I don't know. I think uh, there might be a checkpoint right here anyway. Uh, there, I just went by a checkpoint before I jumped on the ship. Oh, like, really? They're not going to give me another one. Oh, shit. You're, you're right. They're not that generous. What the? It's a cutscene. Oh, oh, no. It's no. Like Fuck off, dude. Okay. I, I don't think they respawn the pirates once you kill them. So I just got... Mm -mm. Uh, they kept respawning. Okay. Last time, anyway. Okay. Do I have enough of these guys? Oh yeah, the only reason that they stopped being an issue because the buzz blades could protect everything. Yeah. Oh, I'm surprised that sword didn't hit you and kill you. There it is. Well, now you know how to do it, so... Yeah, but now I have to save all the bug blades for that. And I'm gonna run out, and when I run out, what am I gonna use? Mm. A couple of times you actually managed to just stand there and stare at the enemy ship and shoot it. And that worked fine. Yeah, just, just focus the ship. That is definitely a scratch. We need to disable those cannons. Okay, I'm standing so close to the ship that it's not even targeting the ship. It's because there's a railing in there. Like, that railing is pretty fucked now. And I'm not hitting them. There we go. Got it. Switch to something else. This is easy because it actually has the over the shoulder aim. Yep. Man, it's almost like this is the only good way to play the game. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. Remember back when I said, oh, this is how it always works and you weren't sure if it was going to be good or not? Yeah, because. I'm not blaming you because you just hadn't tried it yet, but my point is look, it does. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's because the one, the way that it worked in 2 was a little awkward, because the strafe mode only let you... Uh, it really locked your movement a little bit in exchange for... I guess. In exchange for being able to aim better, it did lock your movement a little bit. That said, I'm glad that they did that. It's just that the first implementation was not that good. The way they did it for three, though. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, that's how it works. Okay. Aim at the turret, not at the random pirates on the other ship. <laughs> you can use your dash thing to get more space between you and the enemy pirates. 
Yeah, but then I dash, and then the pirates are fucking right there. Okay, but that was an outlier. <laughs> And I'm hitting the railing again. Like, you, I, you I don't know what I'm doing. stop standing so close to it. That's your issue. You don't have to be close for the buzz blade. You just have to be looking at it. And not have pirates in front of you, of course. But... And I'm done. That's okay. You can just stand there and shoot it with the Star Reaper. You, you keep moving a lot. I feel like you don't have to. I feel like you could dash, let them come to you. And then dash back, and you have, you'd have plenty of time. They're melee only, so you don't really have to keep moving that much. Yes, I do. Otherwise, they get to. Not as much as you do. You have more time than you can use, them, basically. You say that. I would show you, but I know you don't want me to do that, so I will. I will simply say that I can show you. Just like a signature look of superiority. Ah, right <laughs> uh, yes. Look at this simpleton dying <laughs> to, pathetically to this poorly designed level. The real Chads just suffer in silence. <laughs> Does that make um, Nathan the biggest simp in our group? Uh, because he never suffers in silence. That doesn't. But. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop there. <laughs> it's true, he never suffers in silence. He suffers very loudly. He suffers publicly. <laughs> <laughs> Public suffering. There you go. Uh, Shard Reaper, top right. Or anything else, that's fine. I just figured you were gonna go Shard Reaper since that's what you have Shard Reaper was it. Oh, it is? Yeah. And... Fucking hell. <laughs> I got clipped by like the end. Oh, okay, I'm doing this again then. From the beginning? Yep. Cool. That's what I wanted. Well, I, I guess now's our time to fucking grind health as I suffer. <laughs> Fair enough. Hey, we needed time to grind health, right guys? Well, guess what? We're gonna fucking get it. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> As I sh am shooting the cannons. Clank could fucking die for all I care. They replaced him with a jetpack in the game. Clearly he's not necessary. Yeah. That is kind of funny how, like, a large theme of the game is, like, how important their relationship is. Yeah. But then Deadlock comes along and just fucking replaces him. <laughs> <laughs> and nothing. And it's like not even worse. It's a perfectly yeah. fine game. Like, con conveniently overlooks that. <laughs> yeah. Deadlock just didn't care about that. Okay, why are you not locking me? Well, you weren't paging it. I was. But then I had to do it because they were charging me. Oh, are they getting killed by, like, random ricochet? Experts? Yeah. Okay, don't hit the pirates on the other ship. Please, for the love of God. <laughs> okay. Give me back my control. <laughs> yeah, didn't we start this uh, stream with, like, 82 health? We're at 95 now. Oof. I well, don't know whether to be uh, proud or ashamed for <laughs> No, it's good that we have more health. That's all I have to say. That's what we need. Okay. Back to the shitty section. God, how much of this is there? It's probably three. Just because that's, like, the number. I'm pretty sure I died by some random pirate on the last section. Because, of course, that's my luck. Okay. Wait. 
but hit me. I don't know. I genuinely do not know. Something hit me, and I am very curious to know what it was. Yeah, I saw that too. I have no idea what it was. Yeah, see? I, I just had to kill, like, those straggling pirates. Ooh! I, that was it. Yeah, three is the video game number. Three is just the magic number for most things. For most media. Yeah. It's a magic number for jokes, too. Eat beefy green plasma beasts. Something about the third entry in the list just is funnier. Huh. Okay. What what are these dudes? Those are the plasma beasts. Are they like? If you fire extra of them and they don't do, and they don't uh, get used, then they follow you around like that. All right. And you can. And they'll they'll attack the next time something's around. Okay. Mm -hmm. You look like a pirate, but can you dance the jig like one? <laughs> Every fucking door is like, hmm. This dude looks like a pirate, but <laughs> maybe this is why nothing gets done because all the pirates have to fucking jig to access their doors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is a really bad security system. Shake your booty to the sky. To your left. To your left. Shake your booty. Nice. No land number could match that. You mean like this? <laughs> also, this is the only answer to these turrets. Yeah. I find if you get the jump drop on them, you can at least hit them with a couple bombs, and that, that'll usually kill them. Okay. Before they notice it. Mm hmm But, if you don't have the drop on them, yeah, you, you just gotta use the ricocheting blades, because it's the only way to get around them. I, like I said, this whole issue would be fixed if you could just kill the turrets from the front. Yeah, but at least they have, at least there are answers. Yeah, they're just not good ones in my opinion. And the thing is, it's like... I'd be fine with them having a ton of health, so that it makes no sense to shoot them from the front, right? Yeah. But at least let me. <laughs> <laughs> at least give them the option. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Shard Reaper melts while the Magna Cannon does jump at this point in the game. Yeah. At least we have more than one weapon we can use now. That's true. What hit me? Fuck no. you. It's hey, the door! You see that guy over there? No, it's... Is it really the door? It came from the angle of the door. Unless there's a dude I didn't see over there. It can't... Oh, okay, there is a dude I didn't see over there. False alarm door. Okay. Sorry, door. Okay. Bombs on the first page, if that's what you're looking for. Top left. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting that the bombs are there. You got the drop on them, so you should be able to toss a couple of them in here. That's what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. Easy money. Where'd you guys come from? Yeah, I only saw one of them. Was yeah. the other one just jacking off behind the boxes? Maybe they just spawned more of them out of fucking nowhere. They left off the ceiling or something. Okay. Okay. Alright, Chief. Alright, Queef. We're gonna, yeah, end, we're gonna wanna, end that thing. If you want to buy the fucking... What the fuck is this? Magnet launcher? Uses polar, polarized raritanium pellets to cast an electromagnetic mesh over your enemies. That could be good. I feel like we should get the negotiator, because we actually have quite a bit of money now. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't think we have to worry about money. Yeah. I think we're getting to that part of the game where we need to increase our arsenal. Pump everything into the negotiator, because we yeah. don't... I'm fine with upgrading the tornado launcher, especially for my, the sake of my own uh, OCD. Okay. But mm -hmm. I don't think it's that useful. Uh, if we can do it in anything else, we should. Dumb and dumb. Dumb and dumb. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing. Bada boom. Bada boom. Oh, we need 
four angles to get the ultimate on this one. Yes. You just gotta fill up the entire top section. Don't bother with the bottom two. Yeah. Eventually we will, but do the mm -hmm. top one. Do everything else up first. Right, now let's figure out what this negotiator can fucking do. It can explode. It can probably kill these guys pretty damn fast. Probably. Like that, probably. But yeah, but first... But not the door. <laughs> first we must dance. Spawn. Back up, gets it. Why is this game so obsessed with dancing? Between the disco ball and these... Mm -hmm. Shake your booty to the sky. Do you want to to the sky? Shake your booty to the sky. Shake your booty to the sky. Do you left to the sky? Shake your booty. Ah, yeah. At least it's better than trying to hold conversations DDR style. I don't know. I thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> At least when you fucked up, it was hilarious. <laughs> Yeah, but they have like two drinks. That's true, it did get old fast. Give it back, Slag. He picked the wrong spot for a bunch of people. But I'm sorry, We'll teach you to meddle in the affairs of Corsairs. That's a good one, Captain. You made a rhyme. <laughs> Shut the beat. I had to do God damn it, Pete. The rats dine on Lombax tonight. That was a surprisingly raw line. Okay. Considering everything else he says is stupid. <laughs> like, it wasn't that extraordinary, but it was notable considering. It was something. Yeah. Actually, let's use our new gun. Well, I can assure you this is not the final boss, but I'm pretty sure... What the fuck? Sure we're getting close. There's apparently insta-kill saws behind you. What the fuck is that bullshit? Not cool. That is And the, it didn't refill your ammo. That is the exact opposite of cool. It's hot? Yeah, so I guess don't jump back. Yeah, I guess. Like shit. Also, this weapon deals visible pixel damage, which means it's much better than the other weapons we have at this point in the game. Yeah? Can you charge it up or anything by holding, or does that just fire? No. Also, I don't know how I'm supposed to avoid it. Well, here's your chance. Well, it appears you can shoot them out of the air, although that seems like a waste of ammo to me. Yeah. Maybe not with one of your lesser guns, but with that... Might as well start throwing out fucking gadgets if you want. Oh, is he invincible at this point? Fuck. Yeah, it looks like it. I think you're just getting some dialogue. Just ready for whatever's next. Oh, this is a good time to use a shard because these guys just get Yeah. Not bosses, but... Okay, yeah. When he does this bullshit, we just need to pull out our lesser guns. The Shark Reaper is good because its damage comes from rapid fire, not from uh, high damage. Also, not for damage per shot. Anymore. This gun seems to. Okay. I, I thought I could. I thought I could jump over a shockwave in time. Get down there. Come on. I know you can do it. I think I just phased it. Yeah, you did. Uh, where is it? Oh, next time he's on the battlefield, throw out a disco ball. Ooh, we need to do that. Oh yeah, we're up to 101 from 95. Nice. That's good. Over 100 health. That's good. Yeah. We can get, like, hit five times now. Yeah. <laughs> we can get, almost get hit as many times as we could in the first game. <laughs> He's coming. Disco ball. I really want to see it. Boy, come get your precious dimensionator. 
<laughs> he's just kind of jiving. He's, he's grooving. Yeah, he's just doing a simple jig. It's not bad. It's probably too fat to do like a complex jig. But Can we get a Ratchet and Clank enemy dance tier list? Thanks. There's no way in hell I'm doing that, by the way. No. Okay. I'm really bad at jumping over these shots. That was a request to the fans, not to future me. <laughs> Somebody make a Ratchet and Clank dancing character tier list. Okay. <laughs> How do you get hit by that every time? Because the, my depth perception is really bad with those things. I can never tell like just how far away they are. Pretty sure this is the second to last boss. Okay. Could be wrong about that, but given that I know this character by name, I'd say it's probably. We're getting there. Yeah, this is a good strat. I like this. I'm not just sure if I like this strat. Just be an <laughs> asshole about it. Yeah, just switch every <laughs> fucking time. Phased. Okay, get ready for pirates then. Lords, come and get them. <laughs> Bunch of tubs of lards. Kill them with calories. Fuck. I need to jump basically towards him the instant he does that. Like as soon as you put that away, you started doing the thing that you capture with it. <laughs> yep. Just my leg. Okay, he's moving, which means. And I jumped too early this time. Just double jump. It's not as much of a pinpoint jump as you double jump. I forgot that I could double jump for some reason. You're out of ammo on that anyway. No, I have nine, bro. No, the other one. The rocket one. You mean I? I mean I kind of knew that. There's some things that I notice. It's just not the earthquakes. <laughs> Don't she know who I am? Phased. Yep. Throw out a zircon or something. I mean, might as well. Yeah. They're not that cost ineffective. I mean, it's certainly not the best, but it's certainly far from the worst. If he has another uh, minion phase, try using the fucking penguin thing. <laughs> that'd be a good time to do it, because if it, if it hits all of them, that'd be awesome. Mm hmm. What would be good? He might, this might be his last phase, though. It might, but he's still got, like, half his health. Yeah, that's true. So maybe he'll have one more. Like, every quarter. Uh. Huh. It's not uh. stunning him. Looks like it's going through him, but I guess it is damaging him. I'm going to assume that it does. What is he drinking? I don't know, he's going to his next phase. It's best to just take him out. It's just like, I'm gonna use my attack! Penguin! No, you're not. Alright. Yeah, I wanna see if it actually works. <laughs> Pete. Pete is just a mini boss. <laughs> yep, it just turns them into penguins. Nice. Alright. Hmm, lightning ravager. Uh, that could work. 
I'd rather play it safe, though. Fair enough. Just don't jump back. <laughs> yeah. Into the insta-kill bus. I, I, I actually forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, actually. Alright, we're gonna no need to pull off yes. all the stops. Because I'm out of the BFG. And I'm out of the other And they're spawning dudes! Not cool. Oh, it's the big fox, too. The ones that, like, insta-kill you. Yeah. Bruh. Oh! Just kill the boss, he's got a sliver of health. Yeah, we have to. Uh... Shargreaver still got ammo. No, I don't. I've got two ammo. Yeah, but he's two ammo. <laughs> you could Pla drop a Pla disco ball. Plasma stalkers? You may not want to jump. Okay. Never mind. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> That needs to be the title card. His beauty is a bright light at the end of the dark tunnel. Who quenches it as far as the eye can see? Each will point a frog and aspire for all. Fare thee well, true, true galaxy. Fare thee well. Captain? Captain? No! Why? Just like that. Now that you're our new captain, you'll be needing one of these gimmicky pirate names. The Dread Pirate Ratchet, perhaps? Hey, good reference. Hi, tis the code, sir. Thanks, but I'd rather have the Dimensionator. Ratchet, we cannot allow it to be used even once. It is too dangerous. I see. No way the Lombaxes could have invented something useful. It is not logical to use this device, knowing the threat it poses. What threat? You know, ever since the rocket sled, you've been nothing but a giant pain in my Quark! What the? What are you doing here? Showing the universe that I'm a superhero. I'm also fighting the mother of all wedgies. Mostly the superhero thing. Or, uh, or huh. put down the Dimensionator. I shall now emblazon my name in the annals of galactic history by hurling this infertile contraption into a black hole. I'm gonna use the bathroom. Uh, this is about to be my level, and I'm pretty sure we're near the end of the game. Yeah. Which planet is that? The Crag Might Home World, Captain. Grog? <laughs> Ratchet. I can download the coordinates to the Cragmite homeworld by accessing Krog's comm unit. Okay, tell him to meet us outside the planet's stratosphere. Come on, we need to get back to Aphelion. I guess we just got that. Hopefully that gave us some money to work with. Negotiator's pretty good, but uh, we don't have anything to upgrade it for right now. Alright. Gotta be ready. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're going outside the cra- we're going to the crag my home room. Mm hmm Excuse me. Sorry. Planet Report. Mmm. I don't know, that sounds pretty final. Yeah. Planet Repor was once the capital of the great Kragma Empire. Kragmites wiped out over a dozen races and decimated countless others at the pinnacle of their empire's rule. Percival Tachyon's empire, by comparison, is the merest shadow of the invincible power the Kragmite race once held. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, welcome to uh, Ratchet and Clank decided it wants to have serious lore now. Mm -hmm. So, if I get this right, the Dimensionator's a really dangerous thing that the Lombax has used to wipe out the Kragmites. Mm -hmm. But now they don't want to use it again. But they had to find it anyways. To make sure that uh, Tachyon didn't get it. I guess. But now... 
Quark has stolen it. Because he wants to get the clout. I guess. Well, looks like we'll have to do this the hard way. Kronk, Zephyr, prepare for a halo jump. Somehow that didn't look like what the cockpit was supposed to do. <laughs> So, Quark said he was going to hurl the Dimensionator into a black hole. Yep. Why? To make sure it wasn't used and looked like a hero by be for being the one that does it. But we're- but we just let him do it. Yeah, but he's an idiot, and, he's and the pod only could go to one destination, and that happens to be Tachyon's front door. Really? That <laughs> seems like a very bad destination. Well, it's because the pod is supposed to go to the nearest planet. Uh-huh. It, the... It's just an escape pod. That's its only purpose. Oh, okay. <laughs> so Quark was just an idiot. Yeah. And we need to bail his ass out. Again. <laughs> <laughs> this time he's not evil. He's just stupid. Yeah. Uh, improvements, I guess? Perhaps. He did some things to help. He just did a lot more to harm. Mm-hmm. He did give us some pretty crucial information, actually. Yeah, honestly, the... Um... Magma gun is not very good at this point in the game. No, I agree. That said, they are just mobs now, so yeah. maybe we can get away with it. Yeah, that's why I was using it. I I remember this planet. This is a fucking war zone. Mm -hmm. So I just wanted to yeah. use everything as much as possible. But Oops. it's a war zone because we're the ones waging the war, not because we happen to be getting between the two sides. Yeah. Precisely. Now, what does the leech bomb do? Just give us health? Yeah, I think it damages them and gives us a portion of the health. Well, that's cool. Yeah, we haven't been using it, but it's it's okay. Uh, I used it once during a boss fight earlier, and it didn't seem to do a whole lot. Eh, uh, okay. It covers like 15 health. That's something. It's like one hit. Okay, I think we need to use the negotiator. On this bitch? Probably. Or the Shard Reaper, if nothing else. At the we, very we least, need, at the very least, not what I was using. We need to break out the big guns for this guy. Because I remember using the um, BFG Ow. on that. Okay. I wasn't expecting that guy that, to shoot over my head. You know, back when we were in jail? Yeah. Oh, level 5. What's the Shard Reaper going to do? Or, we'll find out, I suppose. As soon as we have an excuse to use it. Hmm. I don't see a difference. Me neither. I wish it told us what the difference was. Yeah, it might just be a damage buff, like a pretty substantial one, because it does seem to be wrecking things pretty quick. Yeah, that's true. I think, actually, I think what it is is that the, the damage is more focused now. Hmm. You know, it's more... Maybe. Uh, straight down. That's your ally. Oh. I would explain why he's not dying. It's hard to fucking tell, dude. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, Talwin. Uh, Talwin? Tal Talwin Apogee? I think that's her name. Mm. I'm surprised she's down here with us. I thought it was just Kronk and Zephyr. Yeah, the two disposable guns. Yeah, but no, Talwin's here too. That's actually pretty cool. I, yeah. I know it doesn't really matter, but I always like when games have your NPC allies actually fight beside you, even if they don't really do much. Mm hmm. Just to make just it like, seem like you're a team. Uh-oh. It's just like, <laughs> yeah, we're helping. I didn't realize that was a hole in the floor and yeah, I almost like, died. <laughs> Alright. Still got more enemies, huh? Just a little cluster fuck over here. Mm -hmm. Doom blades. Speaking of doom blades, you got 23 more of them. Yeah. Oh, is that this what, is, is where... Oh, that's what they're calling them now, the Doom Blades. As opposed to the, um... Buzz Saws, they're calling them the Doom Blades. Were they called the Buzz Saws before? Oh, fuck, I didn't realize I had that little help. Uh. Well, that sucks. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, they got remade. Can I refill before this? I can't. I think you can. You were always able to refill in the middle of the fight. It's just the fight usually wasn't there. Double sun power. Yeah. Hardly matters at this stage of the game, but mm -hmm. it feels nice at least. Sure. These guys aren't too much of a threat. Also, I, it's probably worth backtracking to an armor vendor if we're getting... If we get walled here, it's probably worth That's backtracking to an armor vendor. Just in case we have more armor and they just didn't give us access to it easily. Yeah, they didn't give us that notification or whatever. Mm -hmm. They didn't spawn a vendor near us. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point. Because if we could cut the damage in coming from 20 down to like 15 or 10, that would be a huge benefit. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, if I if I lose again, I'll check for sure. If it even lets me leave. Hmm. It's possible it won't. Yeah. These bombs do decent damage. I should be able to take this guy out with them, right? You would think. Unless I run out of them. I'll just throw all these guys out. Let them do their thing, and if he's still alive, then I'll move to something actually good. Hmm. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I gotta stop taking damage from these guys. Yeah, because they deal damage by the truckload. Yeah. These things, I can probably eliminate with the truck. Uh-oh. He's behind me. Joke is to the left of Joke is to the right the around the Also, no. Alright, <laughs> I guess I just forgot in the middle of my sentence. What's the name of that song you were singing? I don't really remember the name. Please die. That's the name of my song. Yeah. Coming to Walmart's near you. On my new album. Uh, the sounds of rapping is fine. Yeah. Please die. Please die. <laughs> It's just that. It's just that audio clip right there. That's it. That, it's like two yeah. seconds. Left. Please die. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear the fucking ratchet clank going on in the background. Yeah. We got a fucking health level up and it saved my ass. Now I gotta start actually playing serious because this run is, I, has been blessed. <laughs> uh, let's throw out a Zircon, sure, and then I'll BFG this motherfucker. I think I killed two of them with one that time. Nice. Because I shot, like, between them. Uh-oh. That guy survived it. He survived with, like, two HP, and then your allies killed him. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> uh, that thing's useless. Sure, fuck it. Let's find out what... Vi oh, okay, no. Let's not do that. I was gonna say, let's find out what Visicopter does, and then that happened. You use it, and then immediately get hit out of it. Okay. Just despawns. Okay, when this thing runs out of ammo, I'm just gonna go to the fucking shop. No more designated survivors. Nope. It's time. We will be our own witnesses. Yes. <laughs> I'm surprised that actually worked. Okay, we're not using this again. This. Uh, yeah. We're gonna at least use the bombs, if not. Because the bombs are still semi usable. Yeah. But we are gonna use every last one of them against this one enemy. Yeah. But hey, it's damaged.
So we need to take down the force field. Alright, we're gonna stick to at least this. What? Okay, how do I... What are these gunnery outposts and how do I take them? Good question. I'm just repeating what they said. Alright, I'm just gonna kill these guys. Maybe we just need to hold out a little longer before that becomes available. Yeah, because all these areas that look like they're probably places we're gonna have to go are all blocked off. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's just a contact sensor. This is cool, I like this. Yeah, this is at least pretty decent. This feels like a final run. Sure. I like how this one poor merchant in the middle of all this. He's like, oh, oh. <laughs> Would you like to? Oh, God! <laughs> so please keep the racket down. Why did I set up in a military base? <laughs> I thought it would be fucking profitable. <laughs> what looks like the war came to me. Yeah. That's what happens when you set up in a fucking military base, you idiot. This is overkill. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, you want to see overkill? Bruh. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I'm satisfied. Devices. We- I fucking yeah, used it, all these. Buy the disco balls. I'm buying everything. They're actually all pretty useful. <laughs> At this point in the game, Ratchet is just a one-man army. Yes. I only came out here for this, but I discovered this by accident. <laughs> Oh boy, Le level up increases damage by a thousand points. Yeah. Now we can insta-kill them twice in a row. With one shot. Tis the nature of the BFG. Fuck it, BFG only. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if they let us do it. Yeah. I don't think the I don't think the ammo is that expensive. Well, let's find out. Okay. Switch weapons real quick. I didn't know you could do that. Okay. I accidentally spent a bunch of stuff. Oh yeah. It's so like 500 bolts. Okay. 500 bolts per shot. We can probably spare that. It is a lot. It's a lot. It's more than I thought it was. Yeah, me too. But at least it's not a thousand bolts per shot. Yeah. At this stage of the game, a 500 bolts is not that much. Yeah. Because we just gained 3,500 right there. Did I complete the thing? Can I go to wherever the new thing is now? Oh, here we go. I just had to activate that. Okay. Let's... Let it whip. Yeah. Uh, hey, you just pushed him into the force pool. I think I might have fucked him. Uh, at least they can shoot through the force field. Yeah. That's good. Can you, like, drift over there? Not if I go at an angle. Well. I accidentally did a side flip. Oh, fuck. That's what I was afraid of. We went back pretty far. At least not to the beginning. Yeah, that's true. That would be pretty disheartening if it went back to the game. Yeah, that fucking sucked. We need to neutralize those outposts. I, all I did was this instead of this. Yeah. What is this, fucking Mario 64? Hmm. Shouldn't punish me that bad for poor platforming. Hmm. Take cover. Creates the smallest explosion ever. Yeah. Just gonna fill this room with sauce. Hmm. Alright. The Velden Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> All right, I've had enough of you, fucks. You're gonna, you're gonna regret whatever you did to make me mad. with the exception of the falling off the cliff part. Yeah, because you were doing pretty well until then. 
Oh boy, another level up. Yeah, these guys are worth a lot of XP. Apparently so. They must be. Because we just got another thousand damage on that gun. This guy's just like, oh, I thought I was going to be selling all of my devices to the Kragmites. But if you're willing to pay, yeah, I will. mean... Three boxes. Totally worth it. Yeah, well, we got something. <laughs> something. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. No, finally. Something. <laughs> Tell one is nice. And yeah, those are those, those other two guys, too. But yeah. we, we, we kind of forget those guys exist. Croc and Zephyr. I know they exist, because this isn't the only game they exist. In, so. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I mean, minus spoilers. This is when characters actually start becoming recurring characters in the series. Okay. Besides Big Al, who was a recurring character before. Until his eye got fucking shot off, and then he <laughs> showed up as a cyborg, and then never showed up again. He's just like, yeah, I'm going to be an important character now, right? No. Yeah. He was like, I know I've been a joke for two games, but now... I'm a fucking hero. I'm a badass. Never shows up again. <laughs> also, when you get the chance, I want to figure out if the negotiator has a uh, non-negligible and cost. Okay, I'll try. It's probably like gonna be fifty gold for that. It might even. No, yeah, I think you're right. That sounds about right. It might be a hundred. So we've got fifteen. Go, go to the ammo shop. Here's yeah, but I think I've used other things. Yeah, but not anything significant. That's right. Fifty-five hundred. That's a lot. Yeah. Okay, so it does have a non-negligible cost, and with that we didn't refuel. Oh, sorry. Just so you don't get caught pant without your uh, trousers down. Yeah. You caught without my negotiating trousers? Yes. We will pretend this line of dialogue never existed. Yeah. Did something happen? Oh, now something happened. This feels like what Ratchet and Clank was supposed to be. With the fucking war shit going on. Mm -hmm. Oh fuck. I believe this is the game that critics called the closest you'll ever get to playing a Pixar movie. <laughs> I personally think that vastly that's vastly more accurate of Kraken Time. But Kraken Time hadn't been released yet, so. They had no idea. <laughs> Why are you using the tickler gun? <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> because he's not focused on me anyway, so it's kind of easy right now. You're going to use all your ammo and you'll still be up. That's a good point. I have nothing else to say to it. That's, just, that's a good point. It's probably right. what's going to happen. Imagine, yeah. if, imagine how dumb you'd feel if that last shot killed him. <laughs> <laughs> Probably about as dumb as I feel right now. Sure. Does this game have contact damage? I don't think you want to find out, but I'm curious if it is. I don't believe so. No. Okay. 
Wow. Okay, that does though. Kind of actually. I don't like this. Wait, I'm no right boxes. Damn it. No. I'll never forgive you, Talon. <laughs> You're dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> These guys dance. Hey, hey! They're getting their groove on. They're tapping their feet. That's pretty alright. They, they understand what's good. Yeah, that's not a bad dance right there. It's better than that fucking pirate dude. A tier. <laughs> See if I can find a way through, you said? Oh, Geolaser. Got it. Ah. Understood. That totally wasn't what the cut was, but yeah. we're not going to talk over the years. I just it. hope we're not too late. Ratchet, Captain Quark may be a lot of things, but I do not believe he would surrender the Dimensionator just to spare his own life. He would totally do that. <laughs> Let's be honest, guys. Yeah, I wasn't even thinking that until you said it, Clank. <laughs> That's one of those moments where somebody says something, and the two characters stop and look at each other like, Oh wait. Oh would, no. <laughs> like, oh wait. This line of logic doesn't go anywhere good. Fuck. <laughs> I am a fool. Yeah, trade out that mustache for a clown nose, why don't you? <laughs> I thought myself a jester, but I am only a fool. <laughs> Oh, hello, final boss. The prince of huh. Rathmites and the son of the Lombardian. On the very ground their ancestors last fought. How do you like my planet, Lombax? It's been dormant for years, thanks to your kind. You're saying this place is an active volcano? I bet he doesn't know how to use it. Okay. Okay, here we go. Watch it just find some Eldritch Horror instead. <laughs> like, oh shit! A third party just arrives and now they all have to deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> now I know the plot for Into the Nexus. No, that's not exactly the plot. It does involve an Eldritch Horror. Though. But that's pretty I, apparent right I from mean, the start. I, okay. <laughs> I'd rather not know that, but I guess... I know that now. Oh. How many times are we going to have a fake out ratchet death? We had one with the black hole. Yeah. Can we just get another you died over this? <laughs> <laughs> no! We're so close to not having to edit. 159. God damn it. Here, take this. <laughs> this is your punishment. You have to play the clank level until I'm done. <laughs> I will get myself killed in order to not have to do the clank level. What is this? Is this important? It has my enemies on it. That's not that important. <laughs> This isn't something I have to sign, is it? No. Okay. I can write on this. What'd you say? 159? Yep. I assume that means one hour and 59. Yeah. Uh... 159... Uh... Uh... You died. 
Putting on this table and then moving it later. Oh boy, this looks safe. <laughs> I thought I could reach that. All right, your turn. Yeah. Oh, think of that. I got to eat a single Rolo. Cool. What? Where are you talking from? The sidelines. Apparently so. Did you actually have to fight these things? Yes. I mean, you could probably run past them. Okay. All oh, right, I can't dash. I'm not ratchet. <laughs> Fuck clank levels. All my homies hate clank levels. Yeah, up until at least cracking time. I think that's the only good clank level. There's some okay ones in there. Mm -hmm. Because they actually decide to give rank Clank some new mechanics. I mean, than... at least this one isn't horrible. It just doesn't do anything good. Yeah, this is an improvement. It's it, it's improved from utterly offensive to mostly like, eh. Yeah. From offensive to bl to bland. Okay. Oh, here's an interact thing. That's what I'm. Charge up. <laughs> Okay. That was what we were supposed to do. Fair enough. Was I the one who got all the clank levels this time? Yes. I think I got one. Oh. So the clank levels were not It was most completely. it was mostly like 80-20 though for you. Yeah. And the ship levels were all me. Although there was only like two or three. Yeah. There wasn't that many in this one. Yeah. I mean, I guess that's probably why they didn't have any, like, ship upgrades. Leather Jives. Yeah, I guess they didn't have any ship upgrades, huh? Mm-hmm. Guess they just kind of decided the ship levels weren't that good. Ironically, they made the ship levels actually okay in this one. Either the ship levels weren't good, or they just didn't want to put excess effort into making a, like, upgrade tree for it. Yeah. But I mean they also didn't include that many. Like you said, like we said. Yeah. They didn't include none. Uh, one of my dudes fucking died, didn't he? Great. Oh wait, no, there's a ton of them over there. No, I have to come back for those, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I can't did, go back. Did the game just brick itself? Uh wait. There we go. Okay. I think this is what I'm missing. Now. Would the time help you? Probably. <laughs> but we're not going to bother. <laughs> I'm halfway here, and I think it's funnier if I don't do it, so I'm just going to not. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Be that one. <laughs> I wish I could edit out me saying that. Because that kind of spoils the joke. <laughs> it's funnier if I just say, yeah, probably, and then don't do it anyway. <laughs> like a fucking idiot. Alright. Okay, looks like that's where we're going. I'm just confirming. Oh! Oh! <laughs> That was brutal. Some of that was actually really brutal. Get out. Get a kill. Yep. <laughs> Dude just gets a face full of glorinade launcher. Like, or the one, a couple of them just got fucking munched on, too. Yep. Can I actually jump? I can actually jump right here. You know what? Just to be safe. I don't trust it. I don't trust Clank at all. That's probably for the best. Cool. Now I can play the actual game again, please. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Need you on that soon. Is this Fastoon? No. I think Fastoon was the was the Come on, Lombax on the wasn't it? Back to the I don't know. Clank? Clank? Clank! Damn it, now we have a no clank level. Uh hopefully this doesn't last long. Yeah, I don't think it will. I'm still pretty sure this is the last level. But the mention of Festoon is concerning. Uh, negotiator. Let's bump the shit out of this. We can't afford it yet, but each Highly compressed napalm cells. Upon detonation, the cells are released and spread sweet-smelling napalm across the area. Your foes will have nowhere to run. Nice. Well. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, we've got shitty route to jump now. Well, actually, at least it's not as shitty as the first game. Yeah, at least he does have a double jump. Yeah, at least he gets a little bit of upward momentum. Mm -hmm. In the first game, you could press the button, and technically he did something different, but all he did was flip, huh. and it didn't actually give you any upward momentum. Yeah, that was it issue. just stalls your descent. Yeah, and not even very much. Mm -hmm. I don't know what these things are, but I'm bringing out the negotiator. <laughs> I don't like these. Oh, wow. Ah! Okay. Hopefully they also deal one damage per hit. Do these things dance? Okay. That's an S tier. S tier. S tier by far. Don't at me. That's an S tier. <laughs> <laughs> what's, your, what's your Twitter handle so we can at you? Um, hashtag, uh, I don't, my, I don't know what my Twitter handle is. <laughs> hashtag. Ah, uh, yes, the thing at the beginning of all Twitter handles. <laughs> and the reason why we say don't at you. The hashtag. <laughs> Alright, fuck these guys. Just like, I didn't even see the explosion just covered up the carnage. Yeah. That's just how big the VFG Ow. is. Jeez, we have what, 120 something now? Yeah, 128. Hmm. Yeah, and we started out the stream with like 82. Yeah, we've actually gotten quite the buff. Yeah, because these guys just have a ton of XP. I think you broke a box. You're right. There we go. Now they're dead. Oh, there's another one. I wish I didn't see. Yeah, good thing we've got the uh, pass through, because otherwise that wouldn't have hit the dude. Yeah. Fuck off with that shit. Okay. Alright, are you just infinitely spawning? Perhaps. It does seem as if that is the case. Let's just grab our health and get out of here. And rare tiny before. No, I think I have to kill them. Oh, this is just a fight room then? Yeah. <laughs> Ah yes, killing things that the rat that the wrench can destroy with fucking max rocket ammo. Yeah, rockets worth what a hundred gold. Yeah, being, if not more. Being generous with the checkpoints. Yeah. Also, we have enough uranium for the items capstone. They probably uh, they're probably being generous with the checkpoints because they know that this shit fucking sucks. Bada boo. Because they know that any time you give. A ratchet level without clank, it sucks. <laughs> and vice versa. I don't know, I don't think this looks like it sucks. Eh, it probably the mobility doesn't feel nice. It probably doesn't feel good, but it doesn't look like the gameplay is horrible. No, it's not that horrible. It's much better than the previous games. Also, you're wasting ammo. Yeah. It doesn't matter, though. Nothing matters at this point. Oh. It's a good thing we're not in the car right now. <laughs> 
with, with a dialogue like that. <laughs> All right. All right, fuck off. Stop. We don't even know what we're hitting. Stop it. Get some help. Yeah, whatever they are, they spawn a bunch of those walkie-talkie boys when they die. Mm-hmm. I don't know what the fuck I meant by that, but I'm just going to pretend. I mean, they walk, I and I guess they talk. <laughs> they really don't. If by talk you mean screech incoherently. Yeah. And bite you. All Kragmites born yeah. after uh, the year 1997 don't know anything about talking. All they know is walk and eat hot chip and die. <laughs> In other words, hungry, hungry cephalopods. <laughs> <laughs> also, why are you using the tickler gun? I don't know, man. <laughs> I can't use the good guns. I can't use the bad guns. What am I allowed to use, Jacob? The mediocre guns. Fair. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> One plasma piece just, just obliterated just all of them. Just fucking body checked three of them all in a row. That was way more than three. <laughs> That was a horde of, like, six. <laughs> Alright. That one plasma beast gets a purple heart for his efforts. Yeah. Props to that, dude. I've had just about enough of you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Stun lock. <laughs> just like, oh, I can't hit. Hashtag rat lock, bitch. Rat lock. You fucking rat. <laughs> this is funnier the longer it goes on. <laughs> like, we're clearly supposed to use the negotiator or the BFG, but we're not. Nah, this works, so why not? <laughs> why not? Alright, the, <laughs> the funny is reaching diminishing returns. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, the best mid tier gun. Yeah. Really, it is. Oh my god, how much health do you have? Yes. I know I'm not using the god tier guns, but still. You come should, on. You should be getting close to killing them. Yeah, I should have killed them like fucking six teleports ago. Right. Fucking fine. And the straggling uh, fucking Crag saws just obliterate those black fragments. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. What's it gonna be? I don't know. That looks like something. It was almost at your death, is what it looked like. Yeah. Okay. He flipped when I only pressed the button once. That's bullshit. I'm calling bullshit. And if it makes me fight anything again, I'm running past it. Alright, cheat. Alright, cheat. It's not gonna let me run past this, is it? Because there really isn't a, a way to like, dash right now. Oh, there is this, though. So I guess I can skip that. Okay. No! No! Uh, I can't run past this shit. Yeah, BFG. Or negotiate. Nah, BFG. BFG is the only acceptable one. I'm done with this area. Imagine trying to do this without the negotiator. Yeah, or the BFG that I had. Mm-hmm. Because the BFG was an optional gun. Mm-hmm. Will you fucking stop? He was teleporting before my attacks hit him, so I wasn't hitting him. Damn. Fucking bitch. We are not going that way again. No, we're going that way again. 
Oh. If I just don't... Okay, I did it again, but somehow it's, it worked that time. Whew. I didn't want to see that a third time. Yeah, me neither. I was getting fucking mad. <laughs> don't be a fucking trap. I've got my goddamn eyes on you. Okay. <laughs> All this for the a drop of gold bolt. The frame slowdowns are really getting me, though. <laughs> yeah, that was odd. Also, was I supposed to go out this way? I, we might be able to just jump down. Because I don't think there's a way out where I came in. Yeah. Yeah, I can just jump down. This looks like the end of a level. Ah, yeah. uh, yes. Well, my team's here. Oh! Is one of them fucking dead? The ratchet with no click. <laughs> How long have you been waiting for that one? <laughs> Longer than I'd like to admit. <laughs> oh. Clank back. Okay, good. Okay. I'm glad that didn't last much longer. God damn it. That means this isn't the last level. Damn it. Well. Well. I was really hyped to fight the final boss. Mm -hmm. I hope I still get the final boss. I mean, we switch off at the final boss at least every day. Okay. Deal. So, knowing... I mean, that's just what we've done in the past. Oh, hey. Yeah, that is true, I guess. We have enough. Which yep. means that no we get I'm we saying. get to continue to play the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pay your game playing tax. Okay, this is actually a pretty good one. Yeah, with the exception of the shit that I added. Yeah. <laughs> Mustachio Furioso. Still the best character in the franchise. <laughs> oh, and we can loop right back to the beginning. Yeah. I think we are going to have to redo this section of the level in the future. But just because I'm pretty sure that place where we encountered uh, Quagmire, <laughs> Quagmire, <laughs> gig, 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 gig. was the final boss arena. Mm -hmm. I could be wrong about that. But first, we just have to suppress an invasion real quick. Yeah. Just no. hang on. Just gotta go stop a war real quick. No big deal. Planet Eglock. Meridian City. Capital of Free Polaris. Oh, set case. So this is where the game started in. Uh, yes. Cool. But Finally back to... There. We're no match for the combined forces of the free planets. Okay. So that sector still holds some agency. Yes. Probably the last holdout, which is why he's going there to mm -hmm. fucking ruin their ass. Yep. So, like, he paid... Ruined so there. instead of taking over the entire galaxy only took over like a third of the galaxy. It seems like it was more than a third. But I don't know. I mean... I don't actually know. He took over a third like the free uh, planets have another third and the other third are just like rogue nations. Uninhabitable uh, cesspools. Uninhabitable or just independent. <laughs> yeah. Ophelion, what's the situation on Meridian City? We're all dead. Population is now at 10% of normal rates. Just, oh no! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Technically, mathematically, that means only 2.5% of the city is destroyed. Because if a quarter was decimated... Yes. A quarter has been reduced to 10% of its normal uh, Wait, capacity. it's reduced to 10% or reduced by 10%? I'm not sure. I'll be here. 
Because then my math would be wrong. It would be more like uh, a lot less. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. Decimated definition. It's probably just going to use the colloquial definition. Um, the first definition says kill, destroy, or remove a large percentage of. Uh, the historical definition says kill one in every ten. Uh -huh. So 2.5% of the city has been destroyed. Okay. Which is what I thought. I figured considering the colloquial definition it was reduced reduce to 10%, not reduced by 10%. No, that's why it's that's why the colloquial definition is so funny, because it's so goddamn far removed from accurate. I mean, 10% of a population is still pretty bad. Yeah, still. that's not good. But, like, people say decimated when they want to mean completely and utterly destroyed. Yeah. And that's just not anywhere yeah. near the truth. Like, a population could come back from being decimated. In fact, it's hardly even a thing. Okay. In terms of pure numbers. Where am I supposed to be going? In here? Statistically speaking... I think you just gotta jump up there. Well, statistically I'm speaking... Uh, suicide rates drop and... Uh, morale tends to actually rise after tragic events. So... To say that, that a society could come back from being decimated is a bit of an understatement. You know? Because they usually do. Because they almost always will. Yeah. Not that that's a good thing, but... Yeah, not that you would want that to have to happen. Yeah. But if it does, I mean, hey, it, it might be better for the survivors. Yeah, at least for a bit. That said, do you want to run the risk of uh, 1 in 10 chance of being, like, murdered? It's a win-win for me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, dumb jokes aside. <laughs> hey, there's your sweet-smelling napalm. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be doing, but it at least looks cool. I think it didn't do anything because the enemies were all dead. But I think, like, when they step on it, it damages them, maybe? Okay. Perhaps. He's definitely doing something. Yeah. The enemies just got colloquially decimated. Yep. So, there was nothing left to mess with. Okay, so now that we've got the armor, we can... Work on yeah. Let's definitely guns. buff that and then buy something that sounds fun, maybe. All right, we don't care about this. I'm fine with upgrading that, but only if everything else that we are interested in is upgraded, mm -hmm. and that is not the case right. currently. So and we could get the magnet launcher, the razor claws. If I'm being thoroughly honest, I kind of want to see what the razor claws are like. I mean, we have enough to get um, one of them. <laughs> one, yeah. That's my point. Or we could. If we don't get the magnet launcher, we could get two guns. Mm. Oh yeah, the nanoswarmers. In fact, the nanoswarmers and the predator launcher are actually really cheap. So yeah. we could actually technically get this, three. This if thing we didn't is get chump change at this point in the if game. If we got all the cheap weapons, we could buy three. All right. I just I want to see what the razor claws do, claws. and it's not like we need anything particularly yeah. bad right now. Claws, swarmers, and the predator. Nice. So We've still got enough for the pyroblaster. <laughs> I mean, do we want to? No. no. I, I'm pretty sure the Pyroblaster is ass. Okay. Um, if I remember correctly. Because it's short range and it doesn't stun. Okay. Um, it does, it actually... I, if I remember correctly, it does decent damage over time. It's just short range and doesn't stun, so it's hard okay. to use. So, let's see. We're almost filled out a third wheel. Nice. Okay, so... I think there only is three wheels. So we might actually have to customize shit after this. Oh, yeah, it's, it's just, just a cool melee. It's attack. just a sword. Yeah, that's what I thought. I just wanted to see because I thought it would be funny. That'd be neat. Do what is the? Oh, we can't see what the special thing is until we get it. Yeah. Um, well, I would say don't prioritize this. Yeah, because this has. Yeah. These upgrades are pretty steep. Yeah. None that's, of them seem to affect reach, which is a shame. I mean, because that's what would be really helpful. I um, mean, he think about this though. What? Um, the lightning ravager deals two hundred seventy-eight damage, but the razor claws deal nine hundred. Yeah. So, how much does the mega bitch weapon kill thing do? Oh, the um, the thing we've been calling the the BFG. The BFG. 
9,000. <laughs> yeah. Almost 9. It's almost 9,000! Yeah, but I think the closer comparison is the Negotiator, which deals... About double 19. what that one does. Yeah, so... But also is way slower and has significantly less ammo. That's true, but we could get the we could bump up the razor claws if we can take all of these upgrade paths. That's I want. I'm curious what the special upgrade is for this. Okay, so I do think, however, that the better investment right now would be the nano swarmers. Yeah. Okay, so I took one upgrade and it didn't improve the damage by much. Yeah. So we're gonna did. have to either sink levels into this or get all of the buffs to make this good. Eh. I want to see what the nano swarmers do. They have a lot of available things. Extra bolts. All right, we'll get back to that later. Yeah, I feel like the nano swarmers are going to be the better investment. Yeah. I think this is cool. I wanted to see it. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be actually useful, but I mean, I I'm glad this exists. It looks cool okay. as shit. Where's the next way to get up? Can I? Oh, okay. oh. It's just the wrench, but it deals tons of fucking damage. <laughs> Uh, the power of Clank. Yes. For the Horde. Okay, we need to try out the Nano We swords. could probably unlock some weird shit right now. Yeah. What do the Nano Swords do? That. Very nice. Yeah, that's alright. It's just a stick you put in the ground and it kills everything. Near it, anyway. Nice. Well, actually, it's got pretty decent range. It's getting shooting them up pretty far now. Yeah. Are you going to make me use up all my ammo? Mm-hmm. Alright, first time killing you. He shot his own dude. That's friendly fire, man. I thought that was turned off. Oh god, oh, so oh god, I'm sorry. I oh. didn't realize friendly fire was on. Oh god, oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh god, oh fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Alright, so I guess the Nano Swarmers are one of our first and only true minion Nancy powers. Yeah, the Plasma Beasts kind of count, but given that they just tackle things, yeah, it's, it's less like minion Nancy and more like a seeking gun. Yeah, it's, it's it works more like a a true to form gun than actual minion Ratchet, Nancy. That switch appears yeah. to control the force field. Okay, fuck off. <laughs> I was trying to be cool here, but you wouldn't let me. I don't know, those last two shots look like they were perfectly aimed. <laughs> yeah, unless like poof and it miss. just hit the wall. Like, come on man. That's why I stopped throwing the <laughs> wrench and started just touching them. Just gently touching. Right, it worked that time at least. Hey, we got a Groovatron ball. ball. Nice. That's good. Get on the ball. The Groovatron ball. Oh yeah. That was the worst shield in history. Yep. Oh, uh, we can't jetpack with this. Yeah, that's the mistake that caused me to fall in that pit like three times when uh, I got waffle iron. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I realized that what happened was he uh, di disabled the screen, but I'd like to believe that you killed him. Yes. <laughs> I just I killed the screen. Mm hmm. <laughs> the festoon that's what this place is, right? Uh massacre. <laughs> Chainsaw massacre. Yep. It it's a different title each time that yeah. we change planets. <laughs> yeah. The whatever this place is called. Chainsaw massacre. <laughs> That's the final sequel, they just ran out of locations. The Chainsaw Massacre? Yeah. It's the Chainsaw Massacre, but on the poster there's a huge space in the middle. <laughs> because they're like, fuck, I don't know what it's the gonna be this time. Chainsaw Massacre. 
<laughs> yeah. No, it, they they do that because the, um, Ratchet came for the people who are making the posters <laughs> before they could finish the title. Yeah. <laughs> the poster's just, like, mostly empty. It's just, like, the placeholder. The Chainsaw Massacre. It's like... That's it, why it's the last uh, title. Yeah. It's the Chainsaw Massacre. And then, like, there's the front cover where you're supposed to see... Like, there's very clearly a hill where Ratchet is supposed to be standing, but he's not there. Yeah, okay, so that guy <laughs> literally ducked in order to avoid two of my shots. Wow. That's what, pretty incredible. What a douche. Yeah. How dare he survive? I'm fairly certain we can beat this game today. Yeah, if this is the second to last level... It might be third to last. Which would be concerning. If it's third to last, then that's probably not going to happen today. Yeah. Well, they mentioned uh, Fastoon, yeah. which is the Lombax planet, right? And I don't think that's the last level. Mm. And that means we probably have to go there. <laughs> now how do you get back, genius? <laughs> <laughs> I know how. <laughs> yep. That was pretty great. <laughs> I had to do it for the memes. It was pretty good. There I was, will admit. There was probably a way to get back, but I wasn't about to have, find out. It may have been the straw that breaks the camel's back in whether we finish the game tonight or not, but it was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> for the memes. <laughs> what other reason is there to do this? Oh shit. I Fucking didn't see these guys here. Ratchet fights the IRS. <laughs> oh, did you just spawn behind me? Not cool. Did you see the did you see the box cover I made for Ratchet Fights the IRS? Yes. But it was <laughs> but it was like covered up partially by the end title oh. parts. Oh uh, yeah. So um I wasn't able to get like the entire glory of it, but I did see enough. <laughs> it's just the fucking like PlayStation box cover art, typical of the border. Yeah. But then like the background is an actual picture of the IRS. Yeah. <laughs> and then the and foreground Ratchet. is like a really shitty rendered picture of Ratchet, Ratchet in a fucking in prisoner's prison gun. outfit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was pretty proud of that one. Yeah, that one was pretty darn good. <laughs> He just looks just the right amount of angry, too. Yeah, he's just like, God damn it, now I have to fight the IRS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's one of my prouder works. Yeah, that that was that was good. That was good. Uh some of the other editing jokes in that video were ugh. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't done this in a while. Yeah. I guess they're bringing it all back. Yeah. Uh, you can shortcut to the. Oh, never mind. You can't. Never mind. I'm crazy. You, okay. have, you have to go in. There. there. And then right down to the one that connects to the end. Yeah, buddy. Oh wait, there's more. <laughs> one notice. more to be. In fact. I didn't notice that one. It's good. It's fine. It's a good it's thing fun. you did. Yeah. I don't want to spend any more time on these dumb mini games than this needed. Yeah. What is with every game and having hacking mini games? I guess it's just a tradition at this point. I understand it with games like Watch Dogs, where that's like actually an important part of the plot. But do you need it in things like this? Uh, apparently. Even in like Bioshock, it kind of made sense because usually you didn't. For most things, you didn't need to do it. You just like you would get a leg up on the enemy if you did it. Mm -hmm. But this is like really, what's the point <laughs> of requiring you to do this dumb puzzle to progress? <laughs> okay, we're out of the negotiator. Weird that I've never really thought about it. It's only because we're marathoning this game. Yeah. Which adds a new fucking puzzle every fucking entry in the series. 
That's the only reason I've noticed it. Why are they getting up after I shoot them with the BFG? Dude, they're like fucking new bosses. Yeah. One Would more you? shot. One more shot. Please. Fucking not. Oh, well, you got some XP. I think you missed one of them with one of the shots, so I think there's still gonna be one alive. Yep. Called it. Okay. Well, <laughs> it's level 5 now, so my ammo got replenished. By it. <laughs> you thought you were free. Oh, well, how wrong you were. <laughs> Look at those dudes just having a fucking huddle over there. Yeah, like, come on. Here's how we're gonna do this. We need to make our game plan quick. During the fucking. <laughs> Gyro. Oh yeah, we've used that once before. Mm -hmm. There's also an armor vendor here. Or some sort of vendor. Well, it's got the big tube, so it has to be an armor vendor. This invasion just in so. Okay. At least we got our health back. Yeah, that's good. Nice of the vendors to include a free heal with all purchases. Yes. Death Springs. I'm curious. Yes. Releasing one oh, person and towards enemies where they will explode on them. Back. Okay. It's worth a try. Well, we've got all the devices now. Yep. That's how you know we're almost done with the game. Yep. Do you do anything here or is this just scripted? This is scripted. Ah. Oh, now you do something. Now you play Marble Madness. Heh. <laughs> Here we go. You know, this, I don't mind as much. Yes. Because I enjoyed Marble Madness. Heh. <laughs> I like how they don't want you to miss the rare canyon here. It's just coming to you. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> just like, oh. You are in the Thunderdome. The blunder down. <laughs> Back in the camera. Work with me, yeah. The blunder down, I like that. <laughs> Pretty good. Staying true to the name. <laughs> what just happened there? I tried to walk up and it wouldn't let me. Try jumping. Okay. I guess it wants me to jump. Oh, oh yeah, I you can, have boosts. I can spam A, but it still doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have to hold it down. Ah, I see. Understandable. You just needed some momentum. Have a horrible day. What a fucking meme. <laughs> Why did this just make me think of Mario Galaxy again for some reason? I don't know. There was ball sections in that. I mean, some of the game sections were balls. No, but like there was also like sections where you had to walk on a ball. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You needed to use the Wii remote to like balance it, right? Chest. Another ghost chest there. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. That's why I think of it. Yeah, now it's coming back. Oh boy. Was this game released before? Uh. Galaxy. Um, because we established that Galaxy was on the Wii, and I'm pretty sure um, Galaxy was like one of the flagship games for it. So unless this came out like really early on, I don't think they have. It was game. this was the first game I of the Ratchet series on. PlayStation. Yeah, I highly doubt that it predates uh, Galaxy. Because we already know Galaxy ripped off Ratchet and Clank <laughs> with its with its primary mechanic, <laughs> gravity. Yeah. Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Classic. Ratchet and Clank. Future. Release date. 2007. October 3rd. October 23rd, 2007. Right, and I'm Mario. Pretty sure it was like 2005. That Galaxy. Galaxy came out. Yes! That's gonna add a few points to my license. Oh, the plot thickens. What? It was also released in 2007. Oh, so they were being developed basically at the same time. Galaxy released it. Let's find the exact release date. November 1st. 
Oh. So no. Huh. This one came out before it again. Huh. <laughs> Galaxy just like ripped off everything from Ratchet and Clank except for, you know, the gun. The characters yeah. and the story and the world. Yeah. But like <laughs> Ratchet and Clank can have that. Yeah. Imagine Mario with a gun. Mario with a gun. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh. You all right, Quark? How did Quark get out from under his stuff? Oh yeah, didn't we go to rescue him and then? Yeah, somehow he got it? out from under Tachyon's stuff. You're correct, but why are we talking about this? I don't know. <laughs> get a hold of yourself, Quark. Ratchet, I believe Tachyon is heading to Fast Two. How do you know? The Sony told me. Then Fast Two it is. Smashing idea. I'll stay here. All right. Aww. <laughs> Sweet moment with the end of his character arc Blank, in this game. Send a well, that's pretty cool. Cool. Tell him we'll need support on fast So I guess we stopped, now. we suppressed the invasion of the allied home planet. And now we're going to Fastune. To take the fight to the... It occurs to me I may have been mistaken and Fastune might actually be the last world. Well, then I guess it's all yours again, my friend. What's up here? You already were in the game. Okay. I didn't realize this place lived around, but it apparently does. Huh. Alright then. <laughs> Welcome to Dark Souls level design. In a game that does not need Dark Souls level design. Yeah, truthfully. Oh no, did Dark Souls rip off this kit? <laughs> <laughs> no, Dark Souls I know for a fact was released before this. Yeah, and even if it did, wait. the concept of looping level design is not like something that one specific game Wait, can actually this is the same console generation, so maybe it wasn't. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> the conspiracy deepens. The plot thickens. Somebody who's not me looked that up, and by that I mean the audience, because we're not going to bother. Did Ratchet and Clank secretly uh, kickstart an entire... A generation of video games. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All, every game is just Ratchet and Clank, what do you think about it? <laughs> Ratchet and Clank walked so that the rest of the video game industry could run. <laughs> yeah. Also, I'm pretty sure several other games have done this trope. Mm hmm No, I'm, I'm sure of it. I'd love to say... Can, I would love to say with absolute certainty that uh, those games did not do it, bef d that those games did it before this, but given our track record, <laughs> it's possible. I mean. Possible this game started that too. <laughs> the sort of Halo jumps. Did Halo rip off, <laughs> rip off Ratchet and Clank? Okay, absolutely not. Halo. <laughs> Halo was uh, Xbox uh, original. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Well, what, do I, what do they call it now? The XBX or something? The Xbox, I guess. Yeah. It's just an Xbox. <laughs> the Xbox. Oh, hey, we. this is the place from that early game level. Yep. Where we found the ship. Yep. Yeah, it was the Xbox, then the Xbox 360, then the Xbox, Xbox One, One, and then now Xbox it's, One X. Yeah, now it's the Xbox Series X. Yeah. Oh, did they change it to Series X now? I think so. <laughs> I think that's what they're name it. They're calling it now. Because I know they said Xbox One X, and everybody said, "Fuck off." <laughs> yeah. <no. laughs> We're I'm, not calling it that. I'm pretty sure they're just calling it the Xbox Series X. X Bonx. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, sorry. My brain shut off while I was making that joke. <laughs> I just like. Your my... brain's like buffering. Yeah. Uh, 
I briefly became the Cheems meme. Okay. X bonks. And then <laughs> And then my brain just like <laughs> followed suit and became Cheems. And just couldn't process anything. Go Please to, die. Go to X. I don't think this thing was supposed to die. No, it's taking damage. Also, more shit spawned. Try wrenching it to death. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! E. <laughs> yeah, can I get an E? Thanks. Two hours, 45 minutes. <laughs> I'm not actually editing an E in. <laughs> I just wanted to say it. I know. I know. The tickle bit. I know. <laughs> I can tell you were gonna say it. <laughs> I'm like, I know. <laughs> well, stop. <laughs> it's a shame because that gun actually used to be really good. Yeah. And then not too long ago. Yeah, and with the upgrade system, most guns are still. Did he just Sparta kick you into the hole? Yeah. I was gonna say with the with the upgrade system, most guns are still relevant. Yeah. So it's sad that that one of all of them is not. Yeah, it just didn't carry. Yeah. It's a shame. Like, I'm pretty sure the magma launcher was still relevant, like, just last uh, stream. Yeah, and also it was relevant by the end of the game in most games. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not dealing with you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is fine. So, we know the reason why we're here is by a punch from Clay. Yes. But do we know why um, the Kragmites are here? Tachyon came here, probably, I'm an idiot, this is my own fault this time. I've done this to myself. <laughs> Tachyon probably came here because it's the home world of the Lombaxes. And he just wants to, like, flex? Probably. So we're beating up his flex troops. Or perhaps there's an actual reason why uh, we might the whole world of the Lombax is significant besides just thematic reasons. Yeah, we might find out very soon. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Ignoring. Uh, no offense to the last level of this game, which I do love quite a bit, but uh, fuck that one particular hole in there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> I could not have done that if I tried. <laughs> Yeah, fuck that one particular area right there. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna get whatever's in this room, and then figure out where the hell I'm supposed to go from here, because I don't know, actually. Okay, I'm just gonna start shooting. It looks like up there, maybe? I guess. But it looks like I probably won't be able to do that until I kill these This is a, sure is a bullet hell. Yeah. You kind of avoided them on your initial guess, so now you have to deal with the consequences. Yeah. Oh, I'm just supposed to be destroying these things. Oh. They're like anti-aircraft characteristics. Yeah, so because I guess we can't land properly. Hmm. Not shoot that green shit at me. Okay, am I actually here for a reason? One of those dudes turned blue when I shot him with the shotgun. Maybe that has something to do with it. I mean, it might be doing something. Maybe it's slowing them down. That's what I was thinking. Some kind of slowing effect, maybe. I mean, that's tech. Te te that's typically what, what the uh, blue color means in video games. Yeah. You know what it means in music, though, right? No. I'm blue. Shut up. <laughs> I deserve that. For the sake of preserving our friendship, I'm gonna pretend you didn't make that joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think uh, I don't think I'm supposed to be here for any reason. Oh, I maybe I can go up here. I think you were just supposed to shoot down those yeah, turrets. Yeah, I guess that's it. Because that's the only thing that the NPCs are commenting on. But, but how do I go back? 
precision platforming. I'm gonna try this, and if it doesn't work, all right. It almost didn't work. Yeah, I was concerned about that. I was almost ready to eat my words. Use the ass gun to deal with those butt warps. Yeah. Appropriate. What's a predator launcher again? Um it shoots Michael Jacksons at people. Whoa! No comment. No comment needed. Oh. Well that was weird. It like slowly homed in and then like Do we have a vendor we can use to regain our hand? That's what I'm looking for. Cause this looks like it's like semi open world where we have to hunt down the game. Yeah, I do think that's the case, however I don't think I should be worried because I'm pretty sure when I destroyed one of those things it stayed dead. Mm-hmm. So I don't have to go over that section anymore. That's good. So at least we're making gradual progress between deaths. Kind of like another thing you're streaming right now. Yeah. There's actually a lot of uh, common threads between a lot mm -hmm. of the things I'm streaming. Mm -hmm. For a while, it was the theme was death because of Spirit Bearer and Hades. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I was also streaming Risk of Rain with the with the guys occasionally, so it was also um, roguelikes. Yep. Um. Now I guess the theme is whatever that thing was you said. There we go. Slow and steady progress. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's kind of cool, I guess. Yeah, like homing rockets. It, we don't have any levels or uh, augments to it, so it's kind of ass right now. But it looks promising. Yeah. We had these things before, but they functioned differently. We would throw them out, and then they would... Uh, and then they would choose something to home in on. Mm -hmm. Now you hold it and it chooses the thing to home in on, and then they go out and shoot. Okay. That's so, neat. Yeah. So it's we had something very similar, and I think it was the same name. Okay. Before, but now it's uh, slightly mm -hmm. different. <laughs> okay. Are you sure? It I recognize that. Okay, that's an okay switch gun, please. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Oh, did we finally find the health vendor? Alright, Chief. Alright, Chief. All right, Chief. You know what? That's I think we, we should actually sink uh, augments into that um, gun. The Predator launcher? Welcome yeah, because I think... Because it, it looks promising. All right, it all looks right. promising. We just don't have don't anything don't for don't it right now. This powerful laser-guided upgrade allows two rockets to lock on to each target. Worth it. That's cool. Now just give it damage. <laughs> Bada boom. Bada boom. Okay, so I think the Predator Launcher was supposed to be one of the early game guns. You're probably right. That's why we were able to instantly max it out. So, well, I guess we have it now. So the final boss, can we can put more shit into it. It's hull. Fuck. I almost got to this point. Oh. Okay. So we've got another thing we can just uh, shoot people with. Hmm. I was just curious. <laughs> <laughs> Val Alright. Val uh, Val 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 was there a thing here? It looks like there was a thing here. I do not have a very good memory, apparently. I did not destroy a thing there. But it's possible that something got destroyed there by accident in the process. Maybe. Because this definitely looks like somewhere I'm supposed to go, but there doesn't look to be anywhere to mm -hmm. go from here. So I think I'm done over here. Okay. That was odd. Um. The, um... I guess we haven't gone... Where have we not gone yet? I guess wherever that leads. So get to the top of the central monument and then or zip line down. I mean, sure. <laughs> Fuck. 
five. <laughs> that was a very satisfying thing to do. <laughs> just or boop. <laughs> I see you. Zap. All right, let's go with something that's good but not that good. Watch this firefight uh, end up going south because you don't have a BFG ammo. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm one BFG ammo short of killing yeah. some boss or something. Mm -hmm. Or just they, they throw so many mini bosses at you that you use up all your BFG ammo. <laughs> yeah, I know. I brought it out because there was there was those easy to kill things. Yeah. But and then you, they you, all died and immediately a bunch of other shit showed Yeah. <laughs> Try sinking some uh, levels into the guns we just recently bought. Like what? Well, we've got three, so take your pick. Maybe not the Razor Claws. Yeah, I do like these. I want to level these up, yeah. so I'm going to throw these mm -hmm. out. Can we use multiple at once? No, it does not seem so. Okay. That's unfortunate, but So now we it, can do this. It's unfortunate, but it's free to. Oh. Ooh. So this is like something we should be using when it's swarms. Yeah. Swarms of, like, mid-tier enemies. Yeah. Because they do deal decent damage now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Oh, I'm just out of ammo, that's why. Okay. <laughs> Sadness. Oh, shit. Yeah, if I can dodge to get close, these things actually wreck. Okay. These things are a problem, though. These bitches are a problem. That's great. I wanted to see what these would do. <laughs> yeah, they're the not very good. Springs. They're not very good, but they look funny. I guess. At least we got to see the Death Springs. I don't know what this does. What is this garbage? Okay, I guess it's just auto locking. On yeah, it's not that garbage, but it is not great. We've got dropping attacking from an elevated position. What do I look like when I'm doing this? No, I'm just chilling. Yeah. So oh, I did not mean to fire another one. I'm gonna die because of this. Ah! Somehow you gained all your health back. I leveled up. Heh. <laughs> At that exact moment. Nice. Right, it's let's... hard to tell because it doesn't, like, announce your level ups that dramatically anymore. Yeah. It's just a little flash and then the, uh... Yeah. Oh, look at him. Speaking of little flashes and then things happen. Look at him. Heh. <laughs> yeah, that's like an insta-kill thing. Yeah. Return to pain here. Damn, why is your wrench suddenly really good? Because the trade-off is that it sucks getting up close in this game. Yeah, but like, if you could, if the wrench was this good from the beginning, then why were any of the early game goods worth it? I don't know, maybe because they weren't. Speedrun strats just use nothing but the wrench for the first half of the game. Yeah. Or so maybe, maybe the wrench levels up with you. Maybe. Maybe that's it's why like it's... It's like a secret... Maybe that's why it became so much more powerful this session. Yeah, is, that, is it like a secret it level up progression? Like, it deals damage proportional to your max HP? Maybe. I want to see what happens if I do this. Nothing, apparently. Hmm. I want to see what happens if I do this. <laughs> you, you got some penguins. <laughs> that spiraled around him. <laughs> <laughs> it, like, dodged him. Come on, die. Ah! Where oh. did you come from? Ambush. Get the fuck out of here! Get out of here. Your kind ain't welcome here.
minion man, see? Yeah. <laughs> you caught on to my plan! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't have any more of those. Oh, I was trying to select this, but I also don't have any more of those. Okay, anything else that does minions? I guess that's kind of... Technically, in spirit. In spirit. He's got a horde of rogue plasma beasts! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Didn't need to fire that. He's got a beast of a rogue plasma whore. <laughs> oh, we're going up there now. Okay. That's the uh, rule 34 version. Ha. Vendor. Understood. I'm gonna let my minions take that shit out. Okay. Ah! <laughs> God damn it. I knew it was coming the instant I jumped. Uh, it's okay. I wasn't that far, but. Hey, Talon. Talon's alright. I just think her weirdly, like, elf like design is really out of place. Yeah, it's really hard to tell what. Her like design space is trying to fill. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like this world is mostly like it's like... kind of elf, kind of. I don't know what the tale is. Yeah. This world like th this this universe consists of effectively three design spaces. It's robots with like a lot of personality. Animals. Uh, animal characters like Ratchet, Angela, the rest of the uh, Lombaxes. Mm -hmm. They feel a little out of place, too, but because he's the main character, it kind of is excusable. Mm -hmm. And the third category is generic aliens, who look like generic aliens. Yes. And sometimes... And she's none of them. She's like Elf, for some reason. She's the generic aliens from Star Trek, which is to say, just humans with slightly altered features. Yeah. She just looks like something that belongs in fantasy, not sci-fi. I mean. I guess. Because when I say generic aliens, I mean, like, green man aliens. Yeah. Like, she's just not that. Like, yeah, they obviously look like aliens. Yeah. If it looks like it's supposed to be a core race from D&D, &D, it's probably doesn't fit in Ratchet and Clank. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, that's what I'm saying, yeah. That's my entire argument, in a nutshell. Yeah, I was just trying to repeat it. Yeah. Slightly more eloquently. Yeah, no, you succeeded. I'm just, I'm just agreeing with you. <laughs> like, yeah, that's a summary. Man, I sure wish what the special ability of this gun did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, I sure wish these fucking teleporting bitches didn't have a billion health. <laughs> but at least this uh, shotgun seems to be at least dealing them good damage. Yeah, it deals decent enough damage, and it stuns, which is yeah. enough to at least make them pretty pointless. It makes them manageable, for sure. Yeah, it makes them manageable. But it still takes a long time and a lot of ammo. They're getting yeah. at me with that. Oh, no, nope, I managed to die. I didn't think I'd have to die. <laughs> oh, these are the bitches that took a billion shots last time. Yeah. From the Zircon. To, we're gonna need to throw all we got at him. I'm gonna see if I can do that and we'll also do something else. I can't. This is see this is this is the use case for the tornado. Okay, so it's kind of like minion Nancy? Yeah, but you have to control it somewhat. Yeah. It's just, if you can keep all of those things straight in your mind, it can be useful. It's like, yes. If you have the 200 IQ plays, if then you can make it work. If your favorite Star Fox game is Zero, <laughs> <laughs> then we have the gun for you. Yeah. <laughs> This definitely feels like the last level, although it is uh, dragging on quite long. Bit. Oh, 
<laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> this is place again. It's funny to me every time. <laughs> it's one of those things where I just forget about it and then I see it again. <laughs> it's just as funny. I ate them for breakfast. <laughs> Is he gonna pull a Darth Vader and be like, join me? Okay. So... Challenge run for that one guy crazy enough. Beat this game with just the wrench. Yeah, there was that one guy who did it in the first game, but I don't think he would want to do it in this. Yeah, game. Yeah, no, this game is definitely not designed for that. The first, it's much different. The first game kind of felt like the guns were like add-ons, mm -hmm. and the game played mostly okay without um, yeah. guns. It was really hard near the end. Like the last third of the game was really fucking hard to do without it, but you could. With it for that <laughs> but you could do it. It's not a choice if you make all the choices. <laughs> Choosing everything is my choice. I choose not to choose. What the fuck is this? I don't know. Random world building architecture? Random architecture. I'm gonna knock one of these, I'm gonna go with the bolts. For That's now. fine. We don't really need the extra bolts, but. Yeah. Whatever. It hardly matters at this point. We also don't need extra ammo. Mm -hmm. I only did it because I want the fucking. I mean, it's, it's wasted rare titanium if you don't use it. Yeah. I'm just working towards the, the big upgrade. Mm -hmm. He's kind of right. Like, what did we do? Well, we retrieved the uh, Dimensionator from the random pirate. Aw, oh, damn it! I really wanted to stand under that. Yeah. Yeah, we retrieved the Dimensionator from the planet, and then from the pirates. Yeah. Uh, and now... Um... But then Quark... I would say it's more because of Quark. Yeah, then Quark swiped it. What am I doing here? I forgot it wasn't motion controls, and I think I fucked myself over as a result. I'm just gonna wait, because I know okay. I can't do it now. Yeah. Okay, this one's easy. This one's obvious. This one... Oh, fuck. It's one or the other, man. It's gotta go this way. It's gotta be split somehow. Yeah. We just don't know how. Be that way, so it's gotta be down here. One or the other. It's gotta be this one. Because that's how it splits. Yeah, because it'll go here. Gotta and take the long way home. That was actually kind of an interesting puzzle. Yeah. It almost got me. It almost mm -hmm. tricked me. Yep. Good. Very nice. <laughs> now 
Bruh. What? <laughs> Unless you wanted that, you'll still need to do the mech afterwards. Yeah. You're right, because there's the rank after. Yeah, they're turning blue. That's definitely a slowing effect or something. Yeah. And these are the mid-tier warpers, which we can still kill with our mid-tier guns. Yeah. It's the big buff ones that are a problem. It's the big buff ones that we can only really kill with our huge things. But I think it's still got better balance in terms of enemy health than uh, Ratchet and Clank 3. Yeah. These are the Ratchet and Clank games that I miss. <laughs> These are the ones that I was thinking yeah. of when I was like, we should play the Ratchet and Clank games. Because here's the thing, the, the high tier guns like the BFG and the Negotiator are strong, but they have low ammo, so we can't just constantly rely on them. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. I wish I knew that. Mm -hmm. So it still gives a reason for the mid tier guns to exist. Yeah. And the only low tier gun is the starting gun, to be honest. Mm hmm. I think the plasma whip might be low tier. Or yeah, at least it's, the, it, it's, it's more situational. Though. Or at least the bottom of mid tier. Yeah. I'd say the Plasma Whip is situational. It's very good against shields, it's useless against anything else. Yeah. It's kind of one of those weapons that you just pull out when you specifically want it. Mm-hmm. And therefore kind of defies tears. I guess. But, if I had to rank it, yeah, it's probably low tier. I just forgot about it because it's not really a thing. This is also kind of shit, but... Yeah. It actually can be useful because of how much damage it deals. But only against mid-tier enemies, and only if you can dodge well. Yeah. So, a speedrun button. Yeah, I can see it. Okay. Ooh, Court of Azimuth. This is where we said we need it. Yeah. I guess we're almost at the end of the level. So, I guess it's time for our dinner date with Destiny. Yeah. This thing chews through an ammo pretty quick, but at least it deals decent damage. Yeah. Throw another one of these out. Try to dodge that attack before it hits me, because it is right there. What are you doing with the springs? Just tossing one out. Uh, I'm gonna toss a leech bomb at one of these big boys. Because I could use some health back. Not the cover, it's a piece of crap. I think this is the final non-boss section mm -hmm. right here. It seems like it. Because it's requiring the use of basically all we got. Yeah, I haven't gone back to the mid to the low mid-tier weapons, but mm -hmm. uh, now I ha now I kinda have to. This is kinda low on yeah. our priority list. It still works, but it's definitely low mid-tier. Yeah. I find it funny that we have enough Same time. with this, to be honest. I, kind yeah. of works, but also kind of low. <laughs> kind of low just because of the ammo problem. Yeah, because for the damage it deals, it's not worth it. It's not worth the ammo. Yeah, it deals good damage, but it, it just, it's, it's, you use it and then it's gone. Fuck! Oh! That was probably the last enemy, too. Yeah. I'd be willing to bet. Did auto refill me? Did it refill my gear? Oh wait, though? go back to the end of it. Why? Oh, the, we don't have enough. It's two ninety eight. No, we can buy an, another gun. Oh, the magnet launcher. Sure. It's not like we need the money for anything. Yeah, we're basically at the end of the game. Yeah. But let's, this, let's this see magnet launcher is probably good. Oh, we start out right next to the uh, capstone? No, we start right here. The oh. capstone's over here. Okay. Um, well, hopefully this is good. It might not be only because it's not leveled up. 
Uh, it looks like a utility thing. Sure. Looks like something you fire one of and then go to town. As opposed to something you, uh, mm -hmm. you love to deal with. I don't think it deals damage, but it certainly holds them down. That's something, right? <laughs> yeah. We've got a lot of stuff that uh, incapacitates enemies. Mm -hmm. So for that reason, I'm going to start using it. Oops. Found a use for it. <laughs> point blanking enemies when they're because it actually does deal okay damage if you're point blanking them. Yeah. The issue is you just can't do that in any other situation. Yeah, because you're hitting them with all three of your shots, as well as all of the shit that explodes out of it. Mm -hmm. Oh, this doesn't affect the enemies over there. I didn't realize there was a limited range on them. All right. On the uh. The, just go along. Interesting. You're not point blanking. I know, but since I have to use pretty much all my ammo anyway, I might as well start out with the weak sauce on the weak guys. Yeah. There you go. Ammo's out, so you don't have to worry about me using it anymore. This can be useful if you use it in the air. Yeah, because it keeps you airborne for longer. Yeah. So it's good for the evasion, if nothing else. And it does deal good damage. It's The only drawback is the really, really close range, which mm. means it's dangerous to use. But if you're in the air, it's not as bad. I suppose. Like, I'm actually doing okay against these guys right now. Sure. Especially since these guys mostly seem to shoot in line with the ground. Mm -hmm. It's just going to take a little while. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's fine. They do one damage. Do they actually? Well, they do one damage to... Um, Quick, so I'm assuming they'll do one damage to Rachi. I want to find out for okay. uh, Yeah, I don't. <laughs> Ow. Ooh, that definitely deals more than one damage. Whatever that was. This is actually working surprisingly well. Hmm. This one's still low here, I feel like. Oh, those are the mid yeah, those are the mid-tier guys that can get killed by the mid-tier Yeah, same here. There is a big guy here. That's point, mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to bust him out soon. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I, maybe I just saw wrong. I thought there was a high-tier guy here. Well, I think the high-tier guys do shoot that green shirt. Oh, I must have killed him by accident. Or let Kronk and Zephyr kill him. Maybe. Maybe it was just the shrapnel. Yeah. That killed him. Could be. Uh, they're still mid tier, guys. Mm hmm. Oh, get me out of here. <laughs> yeah. Whenever I open the menu and then see a thing about to hit me, I'm like, ugh. Yeah. It's the epitome of the we'll be right back me. Yeah. Court of Azimuth. That's a cool name. What's that? Court of Azimuth. That's a cool name for a place. Yeah. It's also uh, kind of lore relevant. I guess. Azimuth is the name of something important, I'm sure. I oh, just can't put my finger on it. Yeah, I think you're right. I just don't know what either. Yeah. 
hate switches. I'm trying to line them up. Yeah. Because it steals a lot of damage, but doesn't have a lot of ammo. Mm-hmm. Speaking only, of not ammo. <laughs> it only had one ammo upgrade, and it was for an extra one. Yeah. Might as well toss this out, but I'm gonna need to switch to something actually useful. Like right away. Welcome to Star Fox Zero. God dang it. I think you still have negotiators. I do, I was just doing a lot of them. I was just bringing out another tornado. I'm out of negotiators. This I can only put one of out at a time anyway. This I can lock onto him with. Springs do. I can use some health back. Let's toss them on there now, so one minute or whatnot. We are out of everything. At least out of all the good shit. Go ahead, Ratchet. Ah, well, luckily I actually completed the thing, so. Huh. And there's a vendor right there. Yep. Thank God. This is quite the final level, I must mm -hmm. say. Oh yeah, what about that uh, gun we just got? Oh right, we don't have everything on the wheel. I need oh, to yeah. I need to get rid of some of the crap like the hollow guys. Yeah. Um and whatnot and replace it with those new things we got. Mm -hmm. Now that because if it's a final boss for a ratchet and clank, game, we're gonna need to use everything we got. Yeah, and we're not gonna need the hollow guys anymore. That's for yeah. certain. I know for a fact the po the pirate plot line is done. Yeah, like what in the heck was that pilot plot line? I don't know. Really that. though. How do I switch page? There we go. Okay, so question is: anything on this page we don't need? Um, uh, it there are some things, but nothing important. Nothing we can really rule out. Um, okay, we can put this on this. Uh, did we do get any other new guns? I guess the only one we got since the. Okay. So if there's three pages, eight, sixteen, and there's eight per, so that's eight, sixteen, twenty-four. So we, so we have only twenty-five. Well, how many slots are there? Twenty-four. If so we're good. If there's three pages of eight, then so we only need to give up one. I just removed the stupid helicopter thing, mm -hmm. and we have a full slot. So if you got everything in the game, you would only need to forego three slots. Yeah. See, that's much better Yeah. than the previous game. I mean, ideally you wouldn't have to bother, but still. Yeah. Well, luckily there's a lot of useless shit, too. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. three things aren't, isn't really a big deal. Three things is perfectly fine. <laughs> it's a shame it's so close to perfect, but... <laughs> oh, well. I should stop talking, it's a fucking... Uh oh. Oh, so I was actually right that they hit in the pocket dimension. Yep. I just didn't say anything. <laughs> Only two stay behind. Hmm. I think they wanted to say die, but this is still PG-13. Yeah. If I leave you with the Dimensionator, no one will be safe. Not the Lombaxes. Not my friends. I'm not going anywhere until it's destroyed. Get 
<laughs> oh, oh shit, we're going. <laughs> Here we go. It's time to start with the shit. Uh, okay. That's okay. There's a delay before they explode. Oh, that's a that's a pit. Poison gas of death, it seems. Well, it's technically your turn. Nah, you can have another <laughs> go. That didn't count. <laughs> that was kind of bullshit. All right. All right. Okay, so we do have to be aware at the edges of the map you can die. Okay. Let's see, is it all the edges? Most of them, yeah. yeah. It's most of them. So we just gotta stay close, that's all. Sure. I can handle that. Those things have a delay before they explode, so you don't have to worry about landing on them. Yeah, close. luckily. Yeah, that would suck. As long as you keep moving. Yeah, that would suck if, uh... That was the case. It'd be like the fucking things from the yeah. first game. Surprisingly, that's such a fucking fever dream to me now. Surprisingly enough, this weapon has taken off ten percent of his health. Yeah, his health isn't that bad. Yeah, there must be a phase two. There might. I don't remember. Unless, it's possible, unless but... this is one of those like fake chump final bosses that's only okay. Uh, the thing is, I don't particularly remember this final boss, so. Either of those options is equally possible. Yeah. I remember it being an interesting story. Why do I have nothing? Oh, because I didn't have a shot for these. You didn't have a shot for the devices? Yeah. Shoot. Would have been oh, really. This is not going to be useful. Yeah, would have been really nice to know. Oh, that prevents him from using his weapons on you. I see. Oh shit. What? Oh, I remember this now. <laughs> yeah. You were right. Your wormhole devices are dangerous. What? Oh, come on. It's not like one of those hollow films where you think the guy's dead and suddenly. I didn't do anything. I mean, I guess I did, but not yet. Huh. You're the one that opened the fucking portal. Yeah, man. And I really think ruined everything is a bit of a overreaction, given that you have the ability to create portals. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you could just, you know, go back. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I need to remember to keep a debilitating thing on him at all times. Yeah, because that debilitating thing is pretty dope. Fuck. All right. Now it's your turn. Okay. That was quite the that was quite the attempt. <laughs> mm -hmm. A noble effort. Check on the right side to see if I missed any obvious gadgets as well. Um. No. We could just do a full retreat back to the start. Uh, that portal there is probably to the start. The warp thing right next yeah. to you. Where is it? The, I know it. The glowing pad. <laughs> Duh. That's probably to the start. And do we have anything? Weapons. Uh, I think there was one in the center zone. Okay. If it's not there, it's not worth going to. Uh. Just, huh. just circle around the center thing because I think it was near the center. No, maybe not. Hmm. Oh well. Well, that's a bit of a bummer. Yeah, kind of is. Not no ability to refuel our devices. After that huge shootout. Wait, what about too? that? I think that's also guns up there. Yeah. It's worth a check though. Yeah, like after that huge shootout, you would assume they would let you refuel your devices. Because I know there was a right, geez. there was a device refuel somewhere here. Yeah. I'm not crazy, right? No. However, you are walking through the whole level again. Yeah. That being said, there's no enemies, so it's actually a lot shorter. <laughs> yeah. Might as well. Yeah. 
if it's going to give us a leg up. Well, they didn't have the chance. Yeah. <laughs> he said it himself that it was an infant son. Mm-hmm. He might have even had a name. Yeah, but we're There's not... nobody around there to tell him what it was. Yeah, we're not gonna find out. It's Ratchet now. I wonder if that's gonna be a plot point of the... Maybe, like, he has some, like, weird name. New game. Hey. 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 Ayo! Alright. That, that's Strategic gonna... advice. Keep a... Keep a uh, debuff on him at all times. Yeah. No matter what it is, just something, anything. Mm -hmm. When it runs out, hit him with another one and then go back to guns. Yep. All right. We should be more prepared this time around. This was like right outside there, by the way. <laughs> it looks like. Yeah, it was. Well, I guess we had to find it out the hard way. It was only like a five-minute detour. Though. I think it was actually the same distance both ways. To be honest. Hmm. All right. Pretty much equal. Distance. We're all good. Yeah. Welcome to the end of the game. Oh, by the way. Yeah. We started out with 82, and we're at 186 health now. Jesus, we've added over 100. We've more than doubled our health in this one session. Yeah. I'm gonna use the bathroom. I realize this is a bad time. It's fine. This is only phase one. Yeah, as long as I keep moving, he really can't damage me during this phase. Yeah, he really just can't damage me. I suppose this was supposed to be the warm-up phase after all. So, it's understandable. I wonder if he refuels his health. Might not be the case. Oh, yeah, just use the mid tier weapons here. No real reason not to. Just gonna hold back until it gets to phase two. Okay. We haven't used any of our good shit here. Ooh. Second stage. This is the part where we throw our fucking corpses at him. Ready? Yep. Okay. Nice jump. It's better than I did. <laughs> I fucking got hit by that shit like an idiot. Yeah, the first I... one I hit that he launched, I dodged by accident. And yep. then the second one he launched, I got hit by. <laughs> and also, I think that was also when I got shoved into the abyss. It's alright, the Pirate King taught me well. Mm. Yeah, don't back up. <laughs> don't back up and properly avoid his shockwaves. Yeah, never back down. Oh, is he getting invisible? It's time. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Oh, I like that. <laughs> I give that a high A tier. I intend to kill you just as soon as this song is over. <laughs> nope, okay. That propels it to S tier. S tier easily. S tier. He has a special dialogue for it. <laughs> just as soon as this song is over. You will be reunited with him soon. He's uh, not in the debuff state anymore. I'll be your uh, eyes on that. <laughs> I can't look at it. Right now, it's a bad time. I'm actually helping. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not big brain enough to keep track of all this garbage. There's always garbage going on. That's why you've seen I've just been throwing random shit out yeah. recently. I like the music. It's good. Yeah. That's a debuff. Yeah, okay. 
<laughs> Do it. For the memes. That's actually doing good damage. Okay, but now it's time to actually get real. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Throw out another debuff, just, yeah, that's one. Doesn't seem to do anything to that, but... Um... Let's see. We're out of... The if you're looking to do another debuff, there's the, uh, the... Those things. Those things actually deal decent damage. I don't. Yeah, you walk up to them. Cool. You were gonna beat him, too. Yeah, I was. It's the edges that are fucking us over. Mm-hmm. I think we're. I think I don't think we need to refill every time. Wrong way. Oh wait. Did we? Oh, we hit the. You wrong activated check a checkpoint. I activated game. a checkpoint. God dang it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Boss keeps edging us. <laughs> That's one way of putting it. Where did that? we step on the right spot, does, would we... Okay, yeah. I think it triggered another checkpoint. Yeah, hopefully. The proper checkpoint. Okay. I was trying to readjust my seat because I forgot that it goes directly into the fight. I wasn't ready, you infernal fool. Yeah, this first thing, there's really no reason to use your high tier step on. Yeah. I don't even have to jump, I don't think. No, you don't. I tried, and you don't have to. As long as you keep moving your back. I'm getting close to the outside, I'm aware. <laughs> Let's see. No. Because well, that makes you stop. Can I launch this out without stopping? I can. Oh. Alright. Now for the real fight. Okay. Now, let's start with a low tier uh, debuff, followed by a mid tier gun, a mid tier gun. Now, unfortunately, a lot of his weapons still fire despite that. Oh, how I have waited for this. Yeah, it seems they trap, or at yeah. least try to predict your location. Yeah, I gotta turn turn around like when that happens. Okay, he fucking jumped to me. Yeah, that was kind of dumb. Yeah, they don't trap; they just predict your. Thing. Yeah. So if you just turn around, then you're safe. Mm-hmm. Good to know. E easy enough to figure out. Good to know. Going right next to me again. Uh, let's toss out a Zircon. Because it's free damage. Yeah. <laughs> no, they wouldn't. They would not allow me to do that. How funny would that be if that's true? Yeah. Oh, so it lets you lock on four times to this guy. Yeah. Or is it three times? It's like six, I think. Oh, shoot. So it uses up your ammo pretty quick. Okay. Yeah, but I get all the damage for it, so yeah. good enough for Gets me. Gets the damage in. Simple enough. I'm I'm scared by how quickly I'm running out of guns to use. 
Yeah, but you saved all the good ones for last. That is true. I can probably kill him with just this now. All right, let's just go to the let's just go to the big boys. Mm -hmm. Are you sure you're on that? <laughs> oh, what shit. the fuck is this? What the? I am dead. <laughs> and with like the same amount of health that I had. <laughs> yeah, I think I lasted a total of ten seconds longer. Yeah. <laughs> Just long enough for him to start doing his new stage stuff. Alright, we're making progress. Watch that last attack be the thing that kills us over and over again for like an hour. Yeah. Oh wow. What a dangerous first phase. Yeah, his first phase is kind of bullshit. Kind of a chunk. But that's probably the point. Hmm. Yeah, they definitely had a mid boss fight cutscene fake out, so. Yeah. That was probably intended. As long as you know the way to Ratchet and Clank, which is to say, move around and occasionally jump. Yeah. You're fine. Next up. Bombs are either works. He makes you, you like, uh,. This weapon makes him like insult. So I so I gotta use it. It's because it's burst damage. Yeah. Alright. I'm not I'm not I'm not brave enough to use the lightning ring. Yeah. I think the plasma stalker actually attacks the burners. Does it? It attacks both. Okay. It's worth using if only because this stage is easy and it's not a very good gun anyway. Mm -hmm. What? Lame. You have to aim for this? Yeah. You haven't used this yet? Oh, uh, I just wasn't paying attention. No. Yeah, you do have to aim for that. Man, I can't wait to play the new one. Hmm, yeah. There's a lot of really promising things in the trailer for the new one, which are all spoilers, so I will not tell you yeah. what they are. But let's just say there's some big fucking implications. <laughs> Actually, I'm guessing because you know the memes, you're aware of at least one of the big fucking implications. Uh, just in case I'm not, I'm not going to comment on it. Well, I mean, if you comment and you're right, then I'll tell you you're right because it's obvious. But if you comment and you're wrong, I just won't say anything. Well, then I know if I'm right or wrong. Yeah, but... Okay, then you must be wrong, because you would know it's incredibly fucking obvious by now. Let's see here. Next up is... Oh, is that some of the Swarmers just for extra damage? They just do damage, there's no reason not to. Maybe even a Zircon. If you, if I you're mean, feeling, it's the final boss. If you're feeling spicy. <laughs> yeah, and it does seem it gives us our shit back between tries, so... You might as well just burn everything you got on every try. <laughs> Imagine if it made us buy the ammo again. That would it's suck. That would suck again. all the ammo. Oh. Careful of the lead. You got close to it that time. It wouldn't let me double jump. Instead, make me side jump. This gun you can actually hold the fire button. Oh, that's actually very good. Mm -hmm. Careful, ledge to your right. I mean left. Yeah. I always get, uh, psyched out by these jumps. Yeah, they're pretty fucking psych psychic, psych cycle. <laughs> None of these words are correct, but all of them are words. <laughs> you're not wrong, but you're also not right. <laughs> well put. Yeah, this is the Ratchet and Clank I love. What's next? Do I have any other mid tier shit? Um. Oh yeah. We've got the, a lot the, of more passive shit you can throw out. Yeah, the predators are definitely mid tier. This is the last mid tier. I think. Yeah, it is six, by the way. Six. Oh yeah, this is some actual shit. How am I supposed to avoid this? Shit? 
I don't know. Just out damage him right now. He's low and you've still got most of your health left. Yeah, that's a good idea. Throw out the throw out the bullshit. It's bullshit time. Bullshit time. <laughs> Random bullshit go. <laughs> bye bye. How am I supposed to beat this? Random bullshit go. <laughs> it's a good thing you saved all those. Yep. Plasma Stalkers. Oh, your health has been low. Yes, but his is about to get even lower. Are you sure? You have 19 health left. Pretty sure two attacks will kill you. Or one. Ah, oh, fuck. I go. Oh! What? I killed him at zero health! Huh? Ratchet from beyond the grave. <laughs> if I'm going down, I'm taking you with me. <laughs> I'm assuming those are the bad kind of black holes. <laughs> Do you remember who gave that to us? No. The plumber. <laughs> what a meme. He was like, you might need this, and then gave it to us. <laughs> Say anything there, but after I say R, put a long V. Thanks. Will you two be careful? Some set is a micro cubit away from popping off. Do you think you can tell me the truth, Clank? About my father? About my purpose? I detected no lie in his voice. But I believe your purpose has already been failed. You vanquished Tachyon. Something even the Lombaxes could not do. Thanks, Clank. Could not, or just chose not to. Failed me. and ran. You said it was broken. From the. Based on what we've heard. Yeah. <laughs> Are these the zone? What the hell? Let him go. It's time to understand your purpose. It's time to come with us. Yes, time to come with you. Clank! What the hell is this? The end of the game. Ah, uh, what a cheap shot. Didn't we already, like, have a canon story for where his home was? Uh, yeah, kind of. It's amongst the somewhat retcons that aren't really retcons. Alright, well, well... Where they just sort of add something and say, technically, we weren't wrong. <laughs> kind of like Angel, like, technically, we weren't wrong. Yeah. But it also makes some weird implications. She's either dead, or she doesn't count because she's in another galaxy. Yeah. Why you gotta leave this game off on a quick one? <laughs> hey, that thing actually looks like the... Dimensionator. A little bit. How did I never notice that after having played this game like four times? 
All I gotta say is, uh, killing the final boss while dead, 10 out of 10. Yeah, that was a, that was a solid 10. <laughs> solid 10 on the meme scale. <laughs> Canonically, Ratchet is dead now. <laughs> the Dimensionator brought him back to life. <laughs> Brought him back Give, from the dimension of hell. Bring it back to for Jose Cookie Duster Benavides. <laughs> yeah. He was the key linchpin in this project. Clearly. TJ Fixman, though. <laughs> Corey Squeak Garnet. What the fuck? Eric Gooch. <laughs> <laughs> Some of these names just sound. Pac Man! <laughs> Paul Pac Man. <laughs> Mark Mike Mamanis Hernandez. <laughs> what the fuck does Shonuff mean? <laughs> Brian the Math Matheson. <laughs> the Math! <laughs> also, I think there's lyrics to this. There definitely is. There are, they're just too distorted for me to understand. I like how Billy's nickname Beast specifically has an exclamation point. Yes. Clearly, there's syntax and how you're supposed to pronounce it. Yeah, it's which like, we may or may not understand. It's like, Billy, beast. If you just say beast, beast. If you just say beast, then you're not pronouncing it correctly. The one guy with a Russian name is just called the Russian. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, his name is Vladimir, after all. Henry to English, Wong. Oh no, he said Henry to English. Yeah. <laughs> James Arnold Taylor as our lead man. Yep. Yeah. And Jim Ward as the only true cork. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's cork in every single one. Oh, well, good. I'm I glad think he's... Ratchet changed, or at least, like, vastly improved. Uh. Well, I'm glad. Because... Well, I'm glad Jim Ward is still getting his bills paid. Yeah. He's the same ass motherfucker. Oh, don't forget the guy who played Pirate 3. <laughs> Danny Man. What about the person who played the Zony that just said, <laughs> You must come. No, clearly they credit Richard Horvitz because he was the guy who voiced the aliens <laughs> in the Toy Story games. Yeah, they just fucking ripped it straight from there. Yeah, no, they just like sampled bits of voiceover from yeah. those movies in order to create the Zony. Yeah. They just credit the him out of uh, kindness. <laughs> and, and legal necessity. Yes. <laughs> so yeah, that's how this one ends. Yep. And it's the first in a quadrilogy? It's really yeah. a trilogy, though, plus mm -hmm. an extra one tacked on at the end. Plus the, uh, well, it's Quest for Booty Camp. Yes and no. So, it's not a spoiler to tell you this now because you've seen how this ends. Quest for Booty is about Ratchet's search for Clank. Okay. So, it's shorter than all the other games, but in the in the quadrilogy. Mm -hmm. But it's more relevant to the plot than uh, the fourth one. Okay. Into the Nexus. Mm-hmm. So Into the Nexus is kind of its own thing? Yeah. I mean, it's. I, I've said this before, and I will not elaborate on it, I'll just repeat the same thing again. It is thematically linked to the story. Okay. But the real like meat of the of the story ends with uh, cracking time. Okay. Um, like we get all the answers on what the fuck is going on with Clank, and a lot of the very conclusive feeling elements of Ratchet's story. All right. And then they basically just retread the same ground in terms of Ratchet's story in uh, mm -hmm. into the Nexus. And then the new one implies things. That's all. All right. <laughs> Fair enough. I, I don't. I don't know anything because I've only seen the trailer. But the trailer looks goddamn amazing. Yeah, I will say this is definitely the first game that I can very easily award uh, a four out of five stars. This is the first one in the series that I can conclusively say felt good to play from yeah. beginning to end. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a fair point. <laughs> the the third one felt good for the first like eighty percent of the game. Yeah. Um, maybe not even that. Yeah. Maybe the first two thirds. Um, but this one felt good to play from beginning to end. I must say. Which that is, final boss was actually pretty intense. Yeah, it was intense, but it felt like 
you had to use everything in your arsenal to win, but also it was balanced around that. Yeah, exactly. I, I think at least for all of the games, the final bosses have been well, okay. well structured around your abilities. Yeah, the first one had an issue, but it was more of an underlying issue of the way that ammo spawned, Yeah. and the fact that there were only two good guns in the game. Yeah, but once we figured out how the ammo how to get the ammo to spawn, we won in like two tries. Yeah. So I don't think that It was a flaw, but it wasn't a huge... Yeah. It, it wasn't, wasn't a flaw with the balance so much as it was with the underlying mechanics. Yeah, we just didn't understand how the game mechanically worked. Oh, we got the Pirates of the Caribbean theme again. Hey. Um, the second game... The, 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 all the enemies they throw at you at the end of the final boss was kind of annoying. Yeah. But... Overall, not terrible. Mm -hmm. The third game, I actually liked the final boss, although the last minute cop out to have a have a clank mission was kind of lame. Yeah, just pointless. Or no, it wasn't a clank thing; it was a ship thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, the final boss like ended when you beat up Doctor Nefarious, and then he gets into the uh, second uh, MacGuffin and turns into a mech, but then you just shoot the mech down. Yeah, and it's, like, easy, so it's, like, whatever. Yeah. It's just, like, well, who's got the bigger health pool? Yeah. And, it, spoiler, it's you. <laughs> <laughs> plus, it's, plus it's like, all you have to do is rotate and fire, and that's it. You win. Yeah. So it's, like, I mean, okay, but why did this have to be a thing? Yeah. Luckily, it's fast enough that it's mostly forgettable, but it just was yeah. weird. Uh-huh. Didn't uh, feel like the proper way to end it. Mm-hmm. This one it felt like amazing. It felt like that last section should have just been cut scene to win. Yeah, no, I agree. Or just removed entirely. Yeah. Like, what was the point? All he does is get in a robot thing or something. Was it a robot or... or... The Groovatron. Now hey. it's time for us to show off our dance moves. I have no dance moves. That's okay, we don't have a camera set up. <laughs> okay, so I can just pretend... I can imply that I'm dancing. Damn, Jacob, you got some serious moves over there. Yeah, man. <laughs> you know I had this in me the whole time, right? <laughs> An animated uh, skit of this, but it's actually just you sitting in the chair completely still. So it's and, animated. And <laughs> it's just, just a still image of Jacob in a chair. No, it's me, but like <laughs> me, like bumping my head slightly to the left. Yeah, we just do that thing in from like the. Uh, so like two frames. Yeah, two frames. It's like the the uh, mystery skulls animations, how their heads just go. Yeah. With the beat, <laughs> mm -hmm. just slightly. <laughs> <laughs> but no, this one was okay. I I actually feel like this final boss was easier than some of the earlier bosses. It was easier than I would say, um, easier than the third one for sure. Um, no, I mean like uh, in this game. Oh yeah. Like the final boss seemed like it took a lot less tries than some of the earlier sections even. Mm-hmm. Which is a little bit of a weird thing. Oh, they don't even give us the option to New Game Plus? Apparently not. Weak sauce. Yeah. Well, <laughs> were we going to do it anyway? No. Mm. But I well, enjoy having the option. For posterity's sake, yes. we're saving. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. That was, that's this year, right? 11, 11 to 18, that's today. Ah. I'm just going to save over this one, though. Mm-hmm. No reason not to. That was from ten minutes ago. Yeah. Oh. Wait, why did it say one thirty? Does this does the PS three not account for time change? Seems not. Weird. You would need to, I guess, manually adjust it. That's odd. Well, whatever. Huh. Or maybe because I haven't connected it to the internet in a long time, it doesn't know what date it is. Yeah, so it can't auto update. All right. Well, that's the end of this. Uh, as per usual. Mm -hmm. It caused us to extend just a little bit over when we'd usually go. Yeah, but that's not, you know, anything new for the final boss fights. Yeah. Our final boss fights have been conveniently lining up in timing like that. Yeah. Well, anyway, thanks for watching this extra long episode. I mean, except for uh, the one for two. Why? What, did, what happened with two? We kind of beat up the final boss and then did random bullshit. Oh, yeah, we beat up the final boss in like two hours. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. But that's the fair. other ones, yeah. Yeah, the other ones all lined up. Uh, I have a feeling the next game is not going to line up because 
it's shorter than the other ones. Mm -hmm. It might be two sessions or it might be three sessions still, but the third session is really short. All right. <laughs> so anyway, that's all. Join us for uh, Quest for Booty. A hey. the most perhaps the most obvious of the <laughs> Ratchet and Clank titles. <laughs> uh. Wait. All right. Before we shut it off. What? I'm pr No. I don't want to, like, ex <laughs> overextend, but I'm, I'm wondering if it has, um, that, uh, token chick, like, with her back towards you. Just like, ah, uh, yes, the quest for booty. Which oh. booty, what booty are we looking for? Um. Because if she has her back towards you, then that would be a really funny pun. But I don't know if I can make it. Due to the nature of the way the recording works, I can't actually do that. Yeah, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume so, and probably yeah. be proved wrong later. All right. <laughs> All right. Good night. Good morning. Good evening. Good afternoon. Good riddance. <laughs> <laughs> Stay. Ahead.